morning. I almost said good morning. <laughs> what time of day is it? Oh, and welcome back. Well, I, we might not have gone away, but I have. I've got, I've gone away and come back again. Um, it's the vintage continued, everybody, and we've got the wonderful, the fabulous Laura Binding. Ooh. Woo woo! Ooh. <laughs> It's been here all day. <laughs> yeah, you have been here, what seems yeah. like, all day. How, yeah. how have you been here that long? We've been doing DVDs this morning. Uh-huh, mm -hmm. so you have had a long day. Mm -hmm. I've probably had a short shift in comparison to everybody you else. You got to then. go home. I did, I did. I didn't manage I didn't manage my nana nap because I lay on the sofa and I was like, come on, Willow, just have a little sofa snooze with mummy. Have a little sofa. Oh, she's like, okay. And it started off real cute where she's stroking my face. Yeah. You go sleep, mummy. You go sleep. And then just as you're like, yeah, actually, I could go to sleep now, she lifts my eyelids open with my <laughs> eyelashes. So it's like, wake up, mum. Okay. Okay, okay. But you know what? <clears throat> I'm back and I'm raring for more because we have got another astonishing lineup, jewelry makers. Might I just take a moment to show you what we've got planned? So look at these. Oh, my goodness. Going up at the neckline. Look at these beautifully spherical, high-end pearls They're that amazing. are coming up, Sheridan, within this hour? This hour. I mean, so, so beautiful. And if you're thinking, yeah, I love those, I love the sort of the, the classic, the traditional spherical pearls, but maybe they're just a little bit too big for me. Well, don't you worry because we've also got them in your more traditional, shall we say, eight millimeter size. So these are also coming your way within this hour. I mean, aren't they amazing? They're stunning, aren't I they? I love it. Absolutely love it. Um, but also another big, big, big auction. And now this is, remind me, when is the tourmaline coming? What time are we doing that? It is, it has to be your must have. Um, so they were gonna do it at eight o'clock. Um, now Sheridan and I had a conversation um, and Adam, we were all like, right, seriously, have you seen the must have? This is absolutely amazing. And <clears throat> yes, this has been on your screens, but it has been under lock and key for a little while. Um, I've never brought this to air ever. And literally my jaw hit the ground the moment I saw it. Um, these are totally and utterly natural. We are talking some of the rarest of the rare of all tourmalines here, jewelry makers. It is hot pink tourmaline that's happening at eight o'clock today. I mean, the very definition of beautiful is lay across the back of my hand as we speak. Seriously, if you were to look, if you were to look in the dictionary, then that's what this would be under. Do you see what I mean? It is, and that's all completely natural. But um, <clears throat> we've got a little bit of a deal to make here for jewelry makers. Um, because technically, I mean, it's not, I don't care whether it's been on our screens before personally. Personally, um, you might not have been, <clears throat> it's never been on with me, and you might be like me never been able to watch at that particular time so i'm ever so glad that i i have it right now have you seen this before i don't think so no so um <clears throat> now bearing in mind that we have a quantity of 79 um i'm going to is that what you said yeah i'm going to work on the um make a deal with you if we can guarantee that every single one of these sells this evening and we'll do that by you know you showing your interest on the phone lines or on the web, you can't pre-order it yet, um, but, but basically it's a two-way thing. If I see you there and Sheridan's happy, we will take it to a ridiculously low price. Um, because, I mean, it's, 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 it's at a clearance price already, which is, I find amazing considering the caliber of this strand. Um, but we will take it to an ultimate clearance as long as we can guarantee that they all find a home. Because to be honest, it's, this is almost painful for me. It's too beautiful to be in the, in the vault. This needs to be in jewelry. And we are actually going to give the lovely Laura this very strand to work with. I mean, your Christmases have all come at once. I know, I know. <clears throat> I'm very lucky, very lucky. And if you fancy making a nice pair of earrings, you know, mm. oh. one of your friends is sat right here, just saying. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> oh, and Ads wouldn't mind some cufflinks as well. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Should we say hello to? Yeah, we know. Listen, we know. Did did it did 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 did. I started back again. Listen, watch on record. You don't want to miss the live deals, jewelry makers. You do not want to miss the live de deals. What do you mean? Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're starting the show wrong. <clears throat> Good evening, you glam girls and Sheridan. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on a 
a minute. Sharon is just does it. She doesn't have to take that there, Angela. She's like, what a minute. She's not. She's uber glamorous, is she our is. Sheridan. Um, uber uber glamorous. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Take a little look. Take a little look. What have you wow. got? Have you got on your shoulder, Sheridan? Your glasses going... are on your shoulder. You're eating. Oh, what? I've got all of What the... are you eating out of the takeaway box? Chicken and rice, okay. Okay. <laughs> that, I mean, that's still glamorous. She did, however, Angela, she brought in a cheese board today. Did you oh. bring the did you bring the crackers and the packet down, Sheridan? We've got cheese. Yeah, and don't board. forget the biscuits. I mean, that's basically a, we're that's having a per, party it's in my here. It's perfect Saturday night. I know it's amazing. And we're wearing gemstones, like... chocolate, and cheese. Of course, Leah's got the biscuits. Yeah, that was, of, of course, course, of course, yeah. of course. So say hello to our lovely crew. We've got Leah on camera, everybody. Gorgeous Leah. There she is, looking gorgeous as always. Um, behind the scenes, we've got the lovely Lucy. Lovely Lucy. There she is. <laughs> How you doing, Lucy? I'm surrounded by pearls. Surrounded by <laughs> pearls. It's a good place to be. In the gallery, we have got, oh, he's the only man of the evening. But I tell you Whoa. what, I tell you what. Yeah, <laughs> he just said, but what a man. <laughs> it's Adam, everybody. Yeah, Adam. And gorgeous, gorgeous, very glamorous Sheridan, too. Eating her chicken and rice out of a takeaway box. We love you. Okay, so let's have a very interactive show um, because we're kind of going to do a little bit of a make along. So we're going to have a, sh um, we're gonna have a um, clearance ultimate clearance but we kind of want it to be so if you want to know anything even the kits are clearance which is ridiculous you're going to have demos you're still having your demos but if you want Laura to sort of educate you in something what do you want mm. her to demo is there something you want her to make um, then you can text us live here in the studio 60777 start your text with JM Studio I understand you're also going to get this again this is like double Christmas rolled mm -hmm. into one I know <clears throat> I mean perfect for vintage so you're also also getting to play with your Swarovski chain. This is coming up in the nine o'clock hour. I mean, that <laughs> is just vintage, isn't it? Straight away. Perfect. Um, and the price, to quote Sheridan, is insane. Mm. So you need to be with us. Um, but you're going to actually be busy I making am. with this as well. Am, yes. So am I literally handing you these two? Yeah. Do um, we have another studio sample? Oh, no. I don't want to cut this strand. I thought I'll do it. <laughs> okay i'll keep some for you am i get, am i able to have the other things later sheridan what do you mean the other things what else do you want well i've been a bit of a diva today well i didn't like to say a little bit of a okay diva. yeah which what else do you want am i allowed them what else do you want i want the pearls which pearls these these big ones? Both. <laughs> can I do the auction first? <laughs> yeah, you can do the auction first. I'll start prepping. See, I'm being a diva now as well, aren't I? <laughs> Two divas is going to be fun night tonight. <laughs> diva off. <laughs> diva off. Um, okay, let's get this show underway, shall we? Yeah? Um, hang on, Adam's been a diva now. <laughs> he says he's the only diva in this office. <laughs> Hi, Liz. Good evening, Adam. And good evening, ladies. Clarence and Sheridan in charge. Trouble uh, and fun. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed. We're going to have a lot of fun. Um, so, kicking it off in style, I'm going to start with some sterling silver. Oh, I, I've been sat with you. Oh. And, I'm, 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 and I'm already going sterling. So, I beg your pardon, these are silver plated sterling. Because you're from Bristol. <laughs> wow. Is that not very that, good Bristol accent? Wow. No. I love, I love the Bristol accent, so please don't think. Roll the R's a little bit more. I don't, honestly, I promise I have not been drinking this afternoon. Um, so this is silver plated. It's a hook and eye clasp. So can you see... So that's loops in, loops in that way, basically. And it is your finished, um, it is your finished class. So I'll try and uh, tip that forward. Now I've got, you know it's clearance. I've got less than 20 of these available jewelry makers. So very, very limited. If you want the best possible price, it's on your screens right now. One pound, 75 pence only. And these are 
genuine precious metal plated um you know a beautiful class one actually i don't think i've seen before it almost reminds me a little bit of your star signs does yeah. anyone else see that yeah definitely and again if you're multiple you could actually use them both to lock together and have that as like oh, a yeah, side a connector maybe it's sort of part of the design yeah that's a nice nice idea hold those phone lines almost sold out well done okay hello uh hello to Hey, okay. Um, evening, ladies. As a newbie, could you please expa explain to me memory wire and what you can make with it? Thank you. M with what, what couldn't you make with memory wire? <laughs> but I shall hand it over to the lovely Laura. So memory wire is obviously, it is um, a wire that's made of stainless steel effectively. Yeah. Um, so it's good, obviously, for um, your metal. Mm -hmm. um, it's it retains its memory, so hence, hence its name. But what I would say is don't use your normal cutters with it. You can get special cutters um, for memory wire or just use an old sort of pair that, you know, a couple of... Um, not very expensive yeah, because what it, it does, blunt them. It, well, it does. It takes holes out of them. It actually takes little sort of holes into your pliers. Yeah. Um, and then uh, the most common design is to just put a load of chips on, like little see, um, gemstone chips, and then just loop the ends and make a bracelet. It's it's that literally a perfect. Mm. If you imagine a bangle made out of wire, it's that perfect shape, mm. size, etc. All you need to do is a little loop at either end, yeah. pop your gemstones on, That's and it. you've just made your bracelet. You can it's make so simple. Earrings, earrings out of them. Yeah. Ear, uh, you know, glass trams. Yeah. Everything. These would go onto your memory wire, by the way, Angela. Was it Angela? Was it Angela? K. I beg your pardon, K. Um, these would go because Shell Pearl have got quite a nice drill hole, so oh, they'll yeah, go they beautifully go. Um, on memory wire. Three pounds ninety-five. I mean, this is such a beautiful, rich Tahitian s colour. Three ninety-five for eight mil perfect rounds, and that's one of the things that you, we love about Shell Pearls is that they are that perfect spherical shape. You know, there's no, um, there's. A, you're not going to have, if, if, if you don't like the textures of culture pills, then go for your shell pills, definitely. Uh, moving on, should we stick with the shell? I feel like I need more vintage jewellery to wear. Yeah, I need mm. more, I, I need bling to wear. So we'll get working on a pair of earrings then, basically. That would be lovely. Really? Yeah. Funny that. That would be lovely. Just three really simple earrings. <laughs> I'm going to make you do that rap loop. Oh, Sheridan said, Elle, am I going to get you to master a rap loop today on the show? And she I was is, like, isn't we're no, going to do that. That's going to be the challenge. Do it because I'm so bad at it. I've almost, I've almost become frightened of a rap loop. You said now. everybody, you've, you said you've tried and you failed. Everybody's tried and I'm everybody's gonna, you failed. You are, I'm not going to fail. Okay, okay. 3.95 for these only, and they're the same size as the peacock one, so they'll work beautifully together. Hi, Lynn and JP. Evening all. Sheridan, I flipping love you. Um, <laughs> I've been needing Russian chrome dioxide chips, and you got them. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, oh, hiya, Janice, saying, what time is the chrome dioxide on, please? I love it, can't get enough. It's on at 8 o'clock, so you've got, literally, your pink tourmaline, and you've got the chrome dioxide. I mean, two awesome awesome strands um literally back to back right Ooh, what is this i don't think i've ever brought this gemstone to wear seriously i don't think i've ever brought it to wear it's spectralite um so you get this really incredible look almost lavender essence across the surface of them and these wonderful full spectrums of color and that is double-sided, by the way, folks. Oh, look at these. They are amazing. Oh, my goodness. That's beautiful. It's, it, it, it's, you know, like your Labradorite, it needs one source of light, and you'll see these beautiful flashes of colour. Totally and utterly natural. That is a stunning strand. Uh, it's very, very, very high premium Labradorite. But it, but let, Sharon has just, I, I literally have never, never brought this to wear, so I don't know a huge amount about it. Um, I haven't got many of them available though, and you know it's going to a clearance price, jewelry makers. Look at that. Wow, wow, wow. Don't keep your hand. I can't, I can't stop. I can't stop. Yeah. It's got to, I can't stop. I've got to keep it moving. There's less than 10 now because we have lots of collectors dialing through. Well done, well done, well done. Look at that. Who's up for the wrap loop? 
Hi, Karen. Rap loop, yes, please. Having trouble with briolette type uh, drill holes. Oh, that's cool. I and that. even my simple loop earrings end up wonky. Need help. Me too, Karen. See. See. See, I then straight away, I've got my brulette dro uh, drops here, so straight away I can show that. Yeah. And wrap loops. You're going to get me wrap loop in that, I yeah. am. I've got one left of these, so um, West Lothian's on the phone lines, or Annette in County Durham. Who got it? Ooh. Ooh, and Joe in London's there. How many did we have then, Sheridan? Not... Oh, my goodness, I've got to leave that with you. Um, okay. Oh, a sterling silver chain. Chain, chain, chain. Um, oh no, I'm going to have to lay these out on the desk. Limited, these are all stood. In fact, this is the chain auction I think I brought not so long ago. Yeah, I thought so. I just recognised the flat curb chain. It's a really nicely close-knit flat curb chain, so you've got a lot of sterling silver invested. 4.6 grams in total. Um, so you get two different uh, length of chains. You get one eight, sorry, two 18 and one 20, um, 20 inch chain. Can you see that on there? Not really, sorry. Sorry, Adam. Sorry. I mean, <laughs> how, lo how long have I been doing this now? Sorry. How about that? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Here you go. Hold those phone lines. Are they gone already? <laughs> it was my display that did it. <laughs> that I helped with. Yeah. <laughs> it was the white it was the white background that did it. Look at the, look at look at my hand, hand cream has been as well. That's nice. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. That's what happens when you put oil on your fingertips. There we go. Like Thank that. you. <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs> We're gonna have a lot of fun today, which I can feel it in my bones. Um, this with the pearls <laughs> that this lovely person's trying to get her mitts on. <laughs> oh, yeah, just alternate those two. Pearl, peridot, pearl, peridot, pearl, peridot. Oh, they're amazing. Um, can you just give me a sneaky... How much are these going to be then, Sheridan? Oh, my goodness, that's crazy. You want to be around for that, jewelry makers, because they are awesome. Um, so this is a natural gemstone, natural peridot. I adore this gem, and it's always one of those that I push to, uh, to have, like, in a showcase, um, because it's very exciting. It's one of the few that actually forms not just within the Earth's crust, but within the Earth's mantle. And this in, uh, intense colour, this vibrant colour, is all Mother Nature's doing. There's no treatment whatsoever. You know it's going to a clearance price tag. Um, now, I guarantee, or Sheridan is saying, I guarantee the best prices tonight. The best, best prices. And she never, you know, she's never let us down, has she? £7.95 for wow. a, a 30 centimetre strand. Gems a distinction strand as well. And 20 carats. I mean, look at that. Um, I mean, that, <coughs> what, 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 I, I keep it very simple. That would be going with the pills. But what would you do? So, for me, obviously, I've got, like, a rose star necklace here. Um, I would maybe, you know, maybe make some wire leaves and fill them with the peridot so that they would complement the uh, the roses or even use them to make sort of green rose detail. Oh, wow. But I think they would look lovely. So, or just dot them around maybe the sort of the edging around here. Yeah, to give that You know, that just to give flora. that little pop. Yeah. Wow. Soft pink. Okay, sorry. Sheridan just said, <laughs> can you tell me if number 10 is bright pink or soft pink? So I didn't just have all of a sudden a moment just shouting it out. <laughs> <laughs> just so you know. Just so you know. Soft pink! <laughs> Here you go. Well, they look lovely with you, Perido. They are definitely a soft pink, aren't they? Oh, they're beautiful. So earlier on this morning, we were talking about the most expensive, most valuable pearl in the world is La Peregrina. And this is that shape where you have that really beautiful droplet shape. So if you're inspired by, you know, many of the most historic of designs, um, then this could definitely, definitely sort of fit um, within your jewelry making. So um, they are shell pearls. So they've been reconstituted into this perfect, beautifully smooth droplet shape. You've got the drill hole in my favorite position, basically, which is basically from the top upwards um, so you can actually uh, pop a head pin um, you can pop a head pin and just straight up through the drill hole do you want me to count them yeah 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 18 20 21 21 on this strand so how about what 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 that's 62p wow purple 
And you've got large drill holes there that you can actually pop your, you know, your head pin through the centre. We've also got a really nice finding pack coming up um, within this evening's show as well. Um, so, oh my goodness, it's clearance, it's Sheridan, you know what to expect. A minute to win it, jewellery makers. We have to put a little bit of curfew on this price tag, folks, because it is going that low. You are guaranteed the best possible prices this evening, Sheridan says, and I don't doubt her. I don't doubt her for one second. Um, so here we go, minute to win it. Three, two, one, go. Wow. Oh, that was good, Adam. That was really, really, really good timing there. Well done. Single figure price tag for this. Isn't that beautiful? And it is that really wonderful, delicate pink. It makes me think if you were thinking of sort of like um, bridesmaid, yeah. just one of those on a necklace. Maybe those with a chains little, we just had? Yeah, maybe with a little Swarovski crystal, just a little bit of sparkle. Well, as you mentioned, how about something like this? Oh, well, there you go. One of those, just do a wrap loop, which we'll be showing later. <coughs> oh, um, my God. I'm already starting to feel <laughs> clammy. <laughs> and we'll put it straight onto, um, straight onto a chain, and that's so simple. And you've got enough there to make so many pieces of matching jewelry. Look, she just keeps, she keeps mentioning wrap loops. Wrap loops. I genuinely, I, I, I get a little bit anxious about wrap loops. This Is it happens, oh, really? yeah. Um, hi, Jenny. Sorry, Elle. I would really appreciate a wrap loop demo too. I'm very hit and miss uh, with mine. Um, I've just pressed record in anticipation. Well, don't follow me, Jenny. <laughs> follow Laura, definitely. If I, hey, listen, if I master this, it'll be a eureka moment because it's I've gonna been happen. dabbling in jewellery making since, well, since I joined, which was back in 2011. Um, let's have a little look. I'll have a little look. Right, right. Okay. So yes, I'm with you. I'll, I'll do it, but just I'm not promising that mine will be very good because I'm absolutely useless at them. They kind of go a little bit. Um, look up. <laughs> oh, if you're on the computer, look up. Because there's no picture. I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> really look up more like what? <laughs> if you're on the computer, look up because you haven't actually got you haven't actually got a photograph. Um, uh, this is that new. Ooh. So yeah, you need to look on the screen. That's what Sharon's point. Well, you, well, you didn't say that. You just told me to look up. She was also talking about um, about different poses earlier on, weren't you? Um, Sheridan taught us how to do what's it called? The Jamaican pose. Um, and how how does it go? You just look somewhere random. <laughs> like that. Yeah, like sure. that. Now I'll tell you why we, we, we mentioned that in a few, when, when we bring you a particular auction. Basically there is a reason. Um, anyway, seed pills, we, these absolutely fly out the door. Well, earlier on this morning, Sheridan, we had an auction of seed pills. They sold out 300 of them. Um, <clears throat> absolutely flew out the door. Um, and I don't think this is going to be any different because basically, jewelry makers, you have, sorry, I've got all the um, You've got pills here that they still command those mollusks. They still need the mollusks to actually to produce them. They're not, um, they're not usually that much different in terms of their price tag um, because of the complexities of actually culturing them and also the drilling process. I've got less than 30 of these. They go beautiful with the big, the big pills that we've got coming up within this hour, don't you think? And I'm going to add to that. Ooh, are you ready for this? Hello. Wow. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my goodness. 15 of these left within the vault. Um, ultimate clearance this evening. Good evening, Janice. Good evening, Margaret. Good evening, Sussex Norma. Hello to you, uh, Elizabeth. Hello to you, Sue. Teresa, you're there as well. I hope you're well. I mean, these are so, so, so much. They're needed. And I know that gemologist uh, and head buyer Marie has been scouting for, um, for the more seed pearls because they tend to come into our vault and disappear because they look, they add that detail. They definitely add that vintage feel. Yeah. But they tend Tend to be quite expensive, don't they? Yeah, definitely. I mean, again, you just don't see them very often, but they add that detail so um, importantly. Wow. That's how many are left. We had 300 this morning and they sold out. And they sold out. So, um, okay. Well done. What number? Mm, I put that in the wrong one. Hang on a minute. Oh, my goodness. These are some of the big 
because chrome diopsides, chrome, yeah, I did say, chrome diopsides. <clears throat> did you notice my voice went up an octave then? <laughs> um, some of the biggest chrome diopsides that I think we must have within our vault. These are completely natural. Look at that intensity of green. Look at the size of this one here. Oh my good, $39.95. So you can get diopside all around the world, but ideally um, that most prestigious location is what's on your screens right now. It's Russia. Um, and yet there are rumors that the mine is closed completely. So um, hopefully, hopefully you have it already within your, um, within your stash and within your collection. We don't have abundance of it. And I don't think ever, we ever will actually, to be truthful from here on, uh, here on in. Never say never, but um, a beautiful addition alongside your chrome diopside mine. Uh, one to own as well um, so if everybody checks out you, this is already a sellout why because our jewelry maker viewers are uh, avid collectors they know a thing or two about gemstones they know that this should not be at that price um, okay I've got to move quickly mm, oh what are these they're cool these are very cool so we were talking earlier on about how pearls aren't just spherical pearls. You can get a pearl to um, form a really beautiful, unusual shape. So we had earlier on, um, oh, which was the ones earlier on? What was the ones which had that? No, oh, I don't want puzzle ones. That was it. We had the puzzle shapes, and I think they sold out. I mean, they were very... Um, you know, they had lots and lots and lots of curves and very much detail. These, I've literally got... I mean, I don't even know how to describe them, but they're absolutely beautiful, aren't they? They remind me of, um, you know, like the stacker, kind of when you get the pebble-style pendants? Yeah. They remind me a lot of that, you know, sort of almost like driftwood kind of effect. Oh, wow, very beautiful. So you could almost get some wire and kind of wrap it around the centre of it to make it look like it's been sort of um, stacked almost. Yeah. Do you see what I mean? You've got multiple drill points here as well. You know, so you could actually... You can actually pop most of your beading threads, mm. certainly your silks through these. They're, they're kind of like a beaver pearl or an yeah. icicle pearl, um, which is formed together. I mean, anything is possible, really, yeah. um, because these have been formed by an organic gemstone. Wow, amazing. Well done. Uh, moving on. Um, we're going to bring you something a little bit high-end. Oh, I know what it is. It's my very, very, very favourite of all gemstones and this this is the biggest that I have actually seen in Zavarite garnet how is this in clearance we are talking about one of the I think the most beautiful color gemstone out there and the biggest of size that I think we've ever brought you here at Jewelry Maker <clears throat> aside from this existing strand how on earth is this in a clearance now? I'm, I'm almost getting a little bit... I'm getting a bit defensive right now. <laughs> because Zavarite Garnet, we are talking about a gemstone which fetches thousands of pounds per carat. Um, a gemstone which is completely natural. And a gemstone which was discovered relatively recently. <clears throat> and in that short period of time, you know, in vintage era, I mean, it's perfect for this weekend. Because in the vintage eras, they, we saw a lot of this. Victorian um, and Edwardian times, they, we saw more, more of your Zavarite garnet. And that is because, maybe unknowingly, that, you know, how rare it was. Um, so it's more, more frequent for you to actually kind of to find it in older jewellery. These days, it tends to be used as an accenting gemstone because so little of it actually comes from the ground especially in these sizes. Um, I mean, this was discovered by one of our own gemologists, Campbell Bridges, um, in the National Zavo Park of Kenya, um, which just borders Tanzania. A amazing that we're bringing it to you at a clearance price. Is this going to... Am I going to find this... Am I going to find this upsetting? The best deal that you've ever, ever had on this strand... And I think the best deal that we will ever be able to give you on, uh, on, on Zavarite, full stop. What do you mean, whoa, whoa? I'm not the boss of Sheridan. <laughs> What's the saying? The horse <laughs> bolted before what? 
I put the horse before the cart, or the cart before the horse. Either way, I was wrong. Apparently, that's not your price. Really? That should be your price and then some, to be truthful. This is natural. Get your certificate of authenticity. We've had some very, very high-end gemstones um, today. We are prey but tourmaline. Do you remember, because I put Zavarite Garnet in that same caliber, um, in, in my eyes, probably even beyond, just because it is so, so, so beautiful. How many do we have, Sheridan? Only because I'm thinking I wouldn't mind buying some. There's just under 50 of these. Um, and we are busy today, by the way. So, oh, my goodness. If my, if my darling is watching right now, hun, if, if you, I, I mean, I genuinely would really love you to dial through, honey, because this is crazy. For, for, for Zavarite Garnet, you're going to get a reduction, not just of, you know, a cheeky couple of pounds here, folks. When Sheridan says clearance, my goodness, doesn't she mean it? Oh, wow. Ah, uh, literally though, honey, if you are watching right now, please, can you dial through? I'm talking to my husband right now. Please, please, please. I call him all sorts. <laughs> <laughs> darling, but honey, you're on TV darling, now, honey, oi, <laughs> all of those things. Love you, I love you. Please, can you dial through for this if you are watching right now because I am desperate for this round. I've never seen such size in a Zavarite garnet. This is a natural treasure. Get your certificate of authenticity. 55 carats of Zavarite garnet. I mean, to be, if you're lucky enough, right, I, I know that it's Saturday night. I know you've had an, aw an awesome, 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 awesome weekend, stroke, stroke day, stroke week, etc. But this is an opportunity that, in my eyes, I can't afford not to get. Mm -hmm. and that's why I'm thinking I want to get hold of it because I can't guarantee that um, you know that, that, that we'll be able to purchase this size, this scale, and certainly at that price tag ever again. I almost want to do a little whoa, 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 whoa. There's not enough people reacting to this right now. Um, so sorry, Sheridan. That I feel like. Maybe you're having a little bit of, okay, just wind down. It's been awesome this evening. I need to wake you up again, jewelry makers, because this is unbelievable. The quality, the gem, the gemstone, the size, the quality, um, the fact that we are at $69.95 for Zavarite Garnet. If you look online, you know, if this is a new gemstone to you, we're talking about one of the top three rarest garnets in the world. Um, and you've got a whole strand, a whole parcel of it. If you look online at pieces of jewellery for Zavarite Garnet, they will be thousands of pounds. They will be. I'm not saying that's what this will be valued at, but it will be considerably more than what's on your screen. So much so that that's almost laughable. Well, um, I'll probably actually have to get a couple of these because that's crazy. Again, alongside the pearls that you've got wow, coming up. Look oh. at that. What a beautiful combination. Do you fancy making that piece? <laughs> do you fancy? Mm. Do you fancy like yeah yeah <laughs> no yeah? I could. <laughs> I'm already uh, pushing my lights. Asking yeah. for a Maybe pink tourmaline, pink tourmaline, pink zavarite garnet, awesome spherical pearls, chrome diopside. Could it be any better? I don't know if it could. I, I'm not parting with that. That's staying there. That's staying there. Um, okay, so you want me number two? Oh, yeah, these are really cool. And very vintage. So. Oh, I love those. These are fab. Yeah, they, and they look great in mm. Sheridan. You know your bracelets that you want me to re stretchy? I'll try to, yeah. So, look, these are Sheridan's pearls. And she was saying the elastic's getting just a little bit loose. So, imagine those in there rose gold, cubic zirconia, all the way round. Mm. Do you want me to do it? Okay. Two ninety five. We are gonna go lower. And this price is gonna be the same price for the next five auctions. Every single item over the next five auctions is going to the next price. So you already know, you already know, these are beautiful, aren't they? So they're described as little rondelles, but you've got 360 cubic zirconia all the way around. Are you ready? You can't see it. Here we go. Right, that's fine. That's fine. Sheridan, can I cut your bracelet? Uh, don't panic, jewellery makers, because I did promise her I would re-elastic it. 
I do like making a stretchy. So here we go. Have we got? Have you got an elastic on you? No, but you've got some right oh, next to you. I've got a threading pack right next to me. They're flying out the door. Let's bring that price onto your screen. Just for the time being, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to show you a couple because that will actually, and then I'll then I'll reelasticate. How many do we have? Is okay. that going to go on that elastic? I think it will. There's less than thirty. Yeah, there's less than twenty of them left. Oh no, we need the point five. Right, I tell you what, we need the point five. Just I... show on a beading thread for now. Go on, yeah, do it on there. Do it on there. Oh, okay. It's a piece of wire. Good luck, everybody. Don't worry, Sheridan. That elastic doesn't fit, but I promise I will redo it. I'll run out and um, I'll run out and get some from the shop. Got it now. Okay, next one. Same price, same deal. What is it? What, hang on, I'm multitasking you. I can see your I'm multi <laughs> <laughs> I could have done that for you, you know that, right? <laughs> Are they pretty, pretty, pretty? Yeah, pretty. Okay, hang on, Sheridan, you can choose if you want. Because we're having a little make-along. Oh, you could even go mix metal. A little bit, a little bit Cartier. We could yeah. go a little bit Cartier and give you the three colours. Do you know what the that. three colours symbolise? It's, it's, it's rose for love. Ah. Um, it's, hang on, say that it's right. Like yellow for friendship, rose for love and white for fidelity. That's the Cartier colours. We've got 30 left of these at 195. Right, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm, I'm bringing the silver ones next, so I'm getting ahead of myself here now. Keep dialing through, and we'll add the graphics for the silver ones. So what do you think, Sheridan? Do you want all colours? Oh. Oh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. I like that. And that, you can imagine being... Can I make a pair of earrings out of the silver ones and the pearls when I get the pearls? Cool. Well, uh, uh, yes. Well, seeing as you're already... You're already I'm already making. <laughs> I'm already making. You're already using them, so, yeah, you know... Yeah, I won't use Sheridan's pearls, though, no, so no, no. I'll, I'll actually no, make... No, well, I'll do this when I'm using... 48 of you need to check out on the web at these clearance prices. We're actually over-allocated, everyone. We're over-allocated. Right, I'll put Sheridan's pearls there. Put that one. Yeah, there we go. And I'll hand those over uh -huh. to you. You're Fine. doing well so far tonight, I'm doing really, I love... This is a good day to come to work. Isn't it just? Moving on to... Oh, my goodness. I, do I need another board? Sorry. I'm getting it for you. You can have this one back. Just give me a sec. Oh, now these are cool. And these are perfect for your vintage designs. Now, can you see... Um, yeah, it's a connector. Can you see that lovely necklace up there, the multi-stranded necklace, necklaces? Now, if you can imagine this necklace, but sort of brought together in like... You, you know, like your curtain tiebacks, how they kind of swoosh upwards or, mm -hmm. um, or just bring them, draw them together. That's what these connectors do. So they, and it gives you the opportunity to make... Um, a triple row. Does that make sense? So all of your beading thread, um, your, be your wire, uh, your silks, etc., will go through these little drill holes there, and then that's what you see. That's what's visible. So your pearls will sit dink, dink, dink um, across. So how many? Um, what are they? Three or three? Four? Yeah. So the other thing you can use them for, and this is a little bit of a twist, is earrings. So if you used um, eye pins or just a piece of wire, you could do a little tiny loop at the top here, connected by the middle one, and have drops with maybe like Swarovski or like you a know, chandelier. Yeah, like chandelier drops. But then you would still get the sort of um, cubic circona showing. Yeah, Jan did a design like that this morning. Actually, yeah, perfect. We had triple figures. We're down to how many? The last 50 of them. You've got to remember that people are getting quantities like threes and fives. That's the way to do it. Hello, Karen, Warwickshire, Ingrid, Amanda, Brig. Hello to you, Olive. Um, hello to you, Margaret, Maggie, Sue, Sharon, Eileen, Patricia. Hi, Jenny. So oh, oh, yeah, Mary and Brian. Uh, just switched on. Well, well. Oh, looks like you look as if I'm going to visit the Queen. Thank you. Oh. Th th thank you. 
Angela, uh, Sheridan says this is a trick question. Um, are any of you three working next Sunday? I was going to come up and visit again. Um, I'm, I'm not. <laughs> I no, am. I'm not. I'm on a late, late show. But if you're coming, if you are coming up, then we, I might be able to pop my head in, Angela. If you are, I might be able to pop my head in. Yeah, I'll be around um, because I'm probably working the day before as well, so I'll probably stay over. So there I'll come go. in a little bit earlier. You're coming up for a workshop. You're coming up for a workshop. And thank you, by the way, Mary and Brian. Thank you. Yeah, I thought I'd try and vintage it up a little bit. So I went for cow print. I don't know why. <laughs> vintage? <laughs> is cow print vintage? I don't know. It is now. It is now. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, all of these components are vintage. <laughs> and what <laughs> Willow said to me earlier, she was like, Mum, she actually said that, you look like a cow. <laughs> you just got to love kids, haven't yeah. you? It's Thanks. Just... Uh, that was us. Then she said, um, then she said, then she said, you look beautiful. Can you do my hair and lipstick like you, Mummy? So I've got a picture. Aww. I've got, I've got, I'll show you actually in the next hour as a picture. And she's going. <laughs> I just... <laughs> lipstick all over her face. Right, let's do the same in the rose gold. Same in the rose gold. <laughs> Adam was going to say cow print earlier on, but he held back. That's all right. You, you, know, you know that I wouldn't get offended. One ninety five only. Um, <laughs> was that what I was wearing this morning? Yeah, fair enough. Uh, One ninety five only. Again, lovely alongside all of your different colours too. Beautiful. And we don't get these connectors no. very often, do we? And just again, even if you want to go classic and you've just got three strands of pearls and just have these in the middle, maybe put two um, and maybe have slightly larger pearls in the centre, it's just going to make them stack really nicely. Well, that's it. They actually keep it all it linear, keeps it all, yeah. So these pearls that you've got here, coming up as a big star buy, I mean, you might not get the three strands, but you could definitely do a double row. Yeah, def and that's the thing. Just because it's got um, three holes there, it doesn't mean that you have to sort of, you can just do a double strand if you want yeah. to. Yeah, you, and you kind of gather it, you kind of gather it together, don't you? Um, okay, let's do the silver, and then we're going to do the pearls, and I'm going to pass them over to um, lovely Laura. Um, okay, so the silver colour, exactly the same design. Imagine silver usually is the most popular. How many have we got, Sheridan, at this clearance price? 70, which is categorically no way near enough. No way near. Okay, the graphics have been on for seconds and already 20% of the stock has gone. So cubic zirconia all through the centre. There's those lovely apertures that just bring everything together. So just imagine it. It's kind of like, um, like, 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 like tying something together, basically, but with beauty. Um, half the stock's gone already. Hello, Maggie. Hello to Caroline, Suzanne, Warwickshire, Kerry. Um, Hello to London, hello to Jenny, nice to have your company as well. Um, yeah, we've got 26 of these left and lots of you are getting quantities like th sixes, threes, yeah. Maggie, who got, who bought eight? Maggie's, Jenny's got six, um, threes, fours, yeah. Eight in London, well done to you, Warwickshire, Devon, Julie, everybody you need to check out if you want to guarantee these deals, and they are awesome, aren't they? Um, keep those text messages, and if you've got any questions in terms of, I struggle with this, I struggle with that, yeah. the wrap loop is coming up in the next hour. Oh, don't make fun of me, though, will you, because I, I openly admit how rubbish I am. And briolette wrapping, we're going to do briolette wrapping, so anything um, else? Let me okay. know. Um, so, we've got the pearls coming out. We've also, I've got to show you these. You've got the three colours of your bolt ring clasps. These are coming up immediately after the star, uh, your next star buy. So, these are available for pre-order right now. But is it time for these beautiful pearls? I have got little love hearts in my eyes right now because these are stunning. They are beautifully spherical. I mean, for me, that is the very definition of classic beautiful vintage design up next <laughs> strand of pearls in my stash that I haven't actually cut yet only because you know no, no you know you know when you just think 
if I cut them, then am I going to spoil the beauty? Because I don't feel confident enough in my own ability. But I'm quite happy just looking at them as they are at this present moment in time. They're still in my collection. They're still in my the family's legacy, if you like. They've still got that intrinsic value. Now, when it comes to pearls, there are lots of different things that will influence the value. And I think I covered that this morning during the deal of the day. You know, um, I was talking about the um, metallic lust has a big influence. Size is huge. You know, um, to, get, to, 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 to get a pearl of size, obviously, it takes quite a long time. Um, these are, are, are beautifully spherical. Spherical pearl pearls are very rare because you've got to imagine these are gemstones that form within water and you can imagine the wind itself one mil per yeah one mil per year uh, it's estimated it does depend on the temperature of the water that a pearl will actually grow so on that base on that basis this is a decade approximately um but you know just imagine it this way so your most waters uh, most pearls um there's only three or four farms now which are actually done out in the open oceans the rest are fresh water and but they still are influenced by the weather conditions so if you imagine sort of very um very windy weather you know the the, the the mollusks are actually going to move and with every single one of those movements it will influence that nacre surface so to get a pearl which is completely you know uniformed almost in its spherical shape commands a very 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 high price tag so if you have ever been to i don't know on bond street milan rome if you've taken a little look to in i don't know through the shop window of a very expensive jewellers you will have found pearls like this usually with an 18 karat gold clasp and usually with a four figure price tag these are breathtaking absolutely breathtaking high luster so that's referring to uh, you know that mirror like reflection that you've got across the surface of those pearls um, I mean that look, look at that just knock them in between um, with some of your silk and I think pearls of this caliber definitely deserve your silk and definitely all day long with your precious metals can I my personal opinion is if you are lucky enough to own these be it in a strand or in a finished piece of jewelry at some point get it valued I know it costs money to do that I know it does but at some point do because this is something that I, I don't know if we'll be able to continuous, continuously bring you pearls of this caliber at these kind of prices. I can't, I, I can't. I can't read the future, you know, I haven't got a crystal ball, but I shouldn't imagine that kind of price tag is, is surely sustainable. I don't know. Pearls like this command four figure prices. Um, we're at 60 pounds and 95 pence. So approximately 36 pearls on a gauge of the size right now. Those in a pair of earrings on sterling silver, I think would command this price tag in most jewelers. And you could do that, you could do that multiple time, times over. You right now, jewelry makers, if we stayed at this price, are paying £1.69 pence per pearl, which is just crazy for a natural near round high luster pearl so high luster basically is like a if you imagine um like a mirror reflection across the surface of the pearl the more reflective the more lustrous because luster um, is, is is a term that we use for light that hits the outside of the gemstone and bounces back brilliance is light that goes inside a gemstone so with pearls it's always luster when they are high luster again you ha you command a much higher price tag then i'm going to show you this so i'm just going to use my blackboard for a moment just because then you can see the, the actual pearl look i'm going to roll this towards you now when a pearl will bob this is actually a technique that they use for gauging whether they are round near round baroque potato all of those terms if they bob then obviously they're one of the previous but for me there's that you know there's there's very little movement at all these tiny little pits I love, I love that within a pearl because it actually just shows people that they are the real deal. These are genuine culture pearls and not your synthet synthetic or faux. We're not stopping at the price tag. How many do we have? Already a third of the stock has gone, but we're not stopping there. I mean, that is, again, the very definition of, I'm looking across at the, at the, at the pictures of your vintage weekend um, um, what do you call that? What do you call that, Adam? Slide, yeah, plasma. I'm looking at that. This is the very definition of vintage for me. And it's timeless. It's elegance. 
It's high end. We have never taken it to the price that you're about to see jewelry makers. Honestly, could today get any, any better? Is it any wonder that we came back for more? <laughs> I want these. Oh my goodness. I want these. That's incredible. I know. So what would you like? You know, earrings? You know those those spinels that Yeah, the black spinels that, that you, you gave me yeah. today. I did that. Uh, and the rubies that I and finally the ruby gave you. That, uh, that you've had, yeah, yeah. So yeah, basically while. I would put that ruby with this. Yeah. Or definitely. the spinel with this. That would be beautiful. Oh my goodness. So we had seventy of them. We don't have that quantity any anymore, jewelry makers. I mean that is absolutely beautiful it has never been at this price tag before and nor should it please 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 do not think that that is any reflection of the true value or worth because it categorically isn't jewelry makers um can i borrow a bust you know if you were you know if, 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 if these have yeah. grown formed within a mollusk for, for, for 10 years approximately and like i said that does depend on the temperature of the water um sorry i'm just wiping my handprint off there <laughs> if you saw this on in a high-end jeweler shop you would be looking at probably four figures i would imagine yeah. um and we had all earlier on today the launch of the dremel pearl drill um so that this would be perfect be for, that. Ideal for that yeah, perfect because you could set little diamonds in there i mentioned this morning too that the jewelers that i worked at when i was um, um a young 20 something it had one little pearl cabinet and it had you know quite a few pieces of jewelry in there but very very high-end pearls like this clusters near round pearls one piece really sticks in my memory and and it was like this it had little um, holes almost drilled in with your Dremel, if you like, into the side of the pearls. And then it had a little bit of yellow gold and a diamond set into each and every single one of those pearls. That was that was five figures, that piece of jewellery. I'm not qualified to say that this will be valued at, but that's my expectation. That's what many people's expectation is of pearls of this calibre. Anything near round. I'm still going on and the graphics have gone. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You can, you can, always, you can always tell when I absolutely love something because I just literally don't pay any attention to anything that's going on around me. Um, okay, what are we doing now? Oh! Graduated necklace. Or like um, the other bracelet of Sheridan's where you've got small, large, yeah. small, large, just alternating them. I mean, that's beautiful. Again, pearl not in or just, you know, restranded with maybe your, you know, your just small gemstones in between. That is the very definition of a princess pearl necklace, isn't it? Yeah. That classic eight eight to nine millimetres, well, eight and a half to nine and a half mm -hmm. millimetres. That very, very definite princess pearl necklace yeah. length. Um, plus it's 38 centimetres. Knot it with your class. That is going to sit beautifully just below the nape of the neck. Um, so £60.95 for that grade. Um, I mean, that's that's an awesome deal already, but you know that we are actually in a clearance jewelry makers. Have we got many of these? Oh, my goodness, we've got quantity. Are you kidding? Do you want something special this Saturday evening, jewelry makers? Would you like something a little bit special? It's been a truly amazing, amazing day. If you do, you need to show Sheridan a little bit of love because we're running out of time within this hour and they're, therefore running out of time within this star buy. In all honesty, I'm going to show you, you know, the best price that this has ever actually been to. So, which is incredible. So you've got, do you know what? Do you know what? We are going to go to a little break. We're going to show you that that is the best price that this strand of pills has actually been to. Now, bear, you might be thinking, hang on a minute, that's higher than the strand previously. Well, that was a ridiculous price. So another indication that that shouldn't have happened um, but what we're going to do is we're going to use these few minutes in the break for you to show your love for this quality and if you want something a little bit spectacular in the star by price then you, you know you need to show you, we need to work together on it um, so if you if you pop it in your basket um, if you've got a phone in your hand that's your way of actually showing us that you want this at that price tag we have got a triple figure quantity which is just amazing and we'll drop that price after the break so you have to stay with us um, for this amazing auction I'm going to be joining the lovely Laura for some fabulous kits and we're going to be doing wrap loops yeah when we come back wrap loops show the love on this and we will drop that price tag jewelry makers do not go anywhere it's going to be truly truly brilliant
Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewelry making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Born here. I'd love you to join me on this Sunday mid show for the return of the most amazing Murano glass beads. I've got some of my favourite colours coming back and I've got four kits with matching seed beads to go with all of them. So join me on Sunday the 22nd for the mid show as part of the vintage weekend. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 65,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker online couldn't be easier. Just head over to our website, jewelrymaker.com, and click on the register link. Simply fill in the required fields and you can shop 24 7. You'll also be privy to a faster checkout and personalized offers. Jewelry Maker, your one stop shop for all your jewelry making needs. voice on to tell you to join us this weekend for our fabulous vintage event. We have 50 brand new pearl products that you are going to be mesmerized by. Some of your favorite guest designers included in that is Fleur, Alison, Jan and more. Pearl deal of the days on both Saturday and Sunday. There's a gorgeous Russian Amazonite bundle, the most tantalizing Murano glass. So do join us here at Jewelry Maker for the Vintage Weekend. deal this is where we work together as a team the team that we are we have a triple figure quantity of this beautiful strand had Sheridan's correcting me of near round pearls that is the very definition of a princess it pearl really necklace, is isn't beautiful it? isn't it Simp I wouldn't do anything other than literally 
restrand this, maybe knot it with, with with a nice clasp. I'd maybe put sterling silver spacer beads Ooh, in between lovely. it, purely because I can't pearl knot. So that, yeah. would, that would be my option. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Well, that's perfect too. Um, and I did promise that we will go lower on, depending on how many of you are on those phone lines, and that's how you show Sheridan the love. You know, it's one of those things, you know, if we can guarantee that they'll all sell in that auction, then um, we'll, go, we'll go to the lowest possible price tag. And I think this is your lowest ever. What's on your screens right now is your lowest price tag that we've ever been to previously. However, because there, there are a few of you there, are you happy? Are you, oh, 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 Sheridan says, no, I'm happy at this price tag right now. There's not enough that will be allocated. But if you, if more of you dial in, if more of you join in on this auction, this opportunity, then we might be able to squeeze it just a little bit lower. At the moment, uh, Petrina, you've got an awesome deal. You've got a very, very, very high-end strand. Marilee in Arizona, Valerie, Cyril, Marjorie, Beverly, Sylvia, um, new collectors, welcome to the wonderful world of jewelry makers. Listen, I think we're about to commit. This will go beautifully with your eight o'clock uh, must have we are already behind on time so you've got to put a, we've got to put a minute clock onto this price tag um, that's how long I can physically take talking about it you can stay on those phone lines and add it to your auction so Stephanie are you ready West Midlands Gail Maggie Amanda Michelle Claire Liz Jennifer Kerry Rosemary Jean Shandy Denise Christine this is low this is very 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 low Oh, it's awfully low, oh. in the best possible way. I wasn't expecting that. Oh. And, 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 and the reason why these two strands, sorry, sorry. Were, 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 were originally the same price is actually because many pearl traders will actually command a higher price tag for your eight, 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 nine millimeter because that is that very ideal size, if that makes sense. It's like a one carat to a diamond, an eight mil and nine mil is your ideal size of pearls, so they tend to hold a higher price tag, jewelry makers. But clearly not this evening. Um, London, you've done it. Stephanie, you've almost done it. We've got people on the phone <coughs> lines as well. People multi-buying, wow, how amazing. Now, web bidders, this price, is it's never been done before, and we cannot guarantee that it will go to this price tag in the future and um, that categorically is way 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 lower than we should be 30 of you have it in your basket some more people joining in hello mary and jerry hello karen um, suffolk london well done hold those phone lines are you wanting this one too this was worth staying here all day for <laughs> So you've got pink tourmaline, you've got some, you've got two be, strands of pink. You've already put your orders in. You're already wearing a pair of earrings. Yeah. She's already, you know. She's already blinged me up. <laughs> now, now I've got some lovely Swarovski and pink tourmaline earrings. All ready. Ooh. This Swarovski is coming up in the nine o'clock hour and it is going ridiculously low. Perfect for your vintage weekend, don't you think? Right, should we do the bolt ring class bundle? Let's do it. So you get all three colours. You get your silver. Do you want that back? No. There you go. Can do. Yeah, um, you get your silver. You get your... Yeah, okay, <laughs> can do. You get your gold and you get your rose gold, but you're actually getting double the quantity of the silver colour. So 60 pieces in total. So that makes up... Um, what's that? What's that? 40 of your silver and then 10 and 10. Yeah. I think so. Um, if I pick these up, you can actually see the size. I always gravitate towards the gold colour. Um, so a classic bolt ring clasp, absolute perfection. That's 35 pence per sterling silver bolt ring clasp, some of which are precious metal on sterling silver as well. Um, and you get 60 of them. So you use your bolt ring clasp, for example, the pearls that we've just had. They'd be amazing for that. You'd use them for your, your charms. You'd also use them with something like this beautiful strand of sapphire that's coming up a little bit later on. Yeah. How lovely, um, you know, if you wanted to make a beautiful tennis star bracelet that you'd use them with. Um, gosh, I mean, the, the pink tourmaline, for example, they all are, are worthy of your precious metal findings. This is a big, big, big bundle, jewelry makers, and you have got um, 60 in total. So that right there, how many did I say? That's 40 of your sterling silver, eight mil six millimeter, I beg your pardon, six millimeter bolt rings, 10 of your gold plated sterling silver, and 10 of your rose gold plated sterling silver. For 30 watt pence each, 
35p. Now, have you ever had to have a piece of jewellery mended or repaired? I mean, I'm talking about prior to your jewellery making days, obviously. And you go into a jeweller's where they've got their own workshop, etc. You'd be paying probably about... 15, 20 pounds just to replace a <coughs> yeah. clasp. I know because that's what we used to charge at the, at the jewelers that I used to work at. It wasn't my jewelers. I didn't set the prices. I'm just saying that's what that's what they used to be. And it takes probably um, that jewelry maker, um, that, that, that goldsmith, silversmith, whichever, seconds to do yeah. that repair. Make sure you check these out. That's a big, big, big quantity of an essential. They're essential goodies, aren't they? They really are. And even if you just want to make little, like you say, little charm carriers. Um, and uh, it is a very common thing I find when people go, oh, you make jewellery, can you fix this? And you're like, I'll oh, have a look. It is normally that the, the clasp is gone. It's yeah. something very, very simple. Yeah. And you, you put a jump ring on, you replace it, and to them, you've just done the best thing in the world. Oh, yeah, you're a genius. Yeah. You're an absolute genius. Well, you can't make bolt ring clasps, can you? It's one of those few findings that we can't actually make ourselves because no. there's real engineering and craftsmanship within there as well. You've just mentioned about being a charm carrier. That's an ideal opportunity for, you to, for me to show you this. This is tanzanite. Do you know, oh, Leah, man. this reminds me of you, actually. Do you know why? Because you've joined Lady Circle, haven't you? My mum used to be part of Lady Circle. They do some... Yeah, they... Oh, was it me that... Oh, there we go. She said she heard about it through me. Lady Circle do some wonderful charity things. Um, it reminds me of the, the, the emblem that you find in... Um, in, in <coughs> yeah, the badge of Lady Circle. So this is solid sterling silver. Yeah, it's the female equivalent of um, round table. Yeah, yeah, the female equivalent of. Um, so you actually get a lovely, round, brilliant cut. It's genuine tanzanite, that perfect cornflower blue. Um, as you mentioned, Laura, the perfect, perfect charm carrier mm. or pendant. Yep. I mean, if do you know anybody that's maybe <coughs> just had a baby? Mm -hmm. um, do you know anybody that is... December babies? A December baby, absolutely, because it is their birthstone as well. The reason we say had a baby is because you gift a tan's night for their firstborn. Mm. Um, and it's also new beginnings. Yeah, new beginnings, yeah. We are going straight down to that clearest price, jewellery makers. Are we going straight down to it? Oh, what? This was meant to be seventeen ninety five. So we've not far off half that price tag for. I mean, look at the quality of that mm. tanzanite in there. I mean, it's not included. You've got you can see all the way down to the coolie of the gemstone. That's a really beautiful quality tanzanite, and we're at ten pounds. I'd be I'd be snapping these up. I, yeah, beautifully, perfect. Beautiful Gift. earrings. Amazing earrings. Mm. Yeah, take that lobsicle clasp off and use it as maybe a connector, a ring, a pair of earrings, a pendant. Well, like you say, you've got those loops, haven't you? So I would be tempted to get three. I'd have to have a pair of earrings and then I'd have to have like the pendant. And you could use those loops to kind of connect some chain if you wanted to. If you had some smaller gemstones to have that as a drop. I just think that's really, oh, a ring would be lovely as well. But, Ten pounds for Tan's night. We are all a little bit flabbergasted by this. And, mm. and Sheridan actually is saying, you know what, Elle, I can't take credit for that price tag. It was already set by, you know, by the team. It's closed at 17.95 in the past, and that's amazing. But under ten pounds, look at the quality of this Tanzanite. I mean, that is that, that, is that textbook mm. Tanzanite blue and textbook Tanzanite clarity. Yeah. How many have we got? Beautiful. There are about 80 of these available. <coughs> wow. Um, yeah. Well, Linda, Debbie, I would be doing exactly the same as you. Um, so new bidders on the web. You've got to check them out if you want to guarantee your success. You've got a really lovely three millimeter tanzanite here set in that gorgeous floral motif with the lobster clasp. Personally, I would use the lobster claw clasp for something else, and this would be a pendant. Yeah, definitely. And we had those sterling silver chains on earlier, didn't yeah. we? So it'd be ideal for that. Very minimal work needed, and again, it's got a lot of potential. Like you can, you could, if you took the clasp off, turn it so that the the connecting loop that the jump rings on is at the bottom, yeah, and then use two jump rings to the side, say here and here, and actually have the chain attached to that, and then have that in the centre with 
a drop. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah lovely. So you've got a lot of potential. Wow. <laughs> pop that pop that on a bale. We had a bale yeah. earlier. Those lovely triangular bales. Mm. Pop it on that too. Beautiful. Um, okay, coming up in about 20 minutes time. We've got all of this. Oh, yeah, this is a really lovely, lovely findings pack. So, mm. um, so it includes an eight-inch length of your chain. It includes one of the most stunning parve set clasps that I think you can possibly wish for. Look at that, very shopard. Look at that. So perfect for your beading and all your pearls. You have these fabulous head pins that include, look at that, is that a cubic zirconia in the center there? Really lovely cubic zirconia. You get two pairs of your shepherd hooks, you get your jump rings and you get your um, crimps and crimp covers and also these really lovely well, pendants really, two of those. All coming up, the price that we're going to is, to be honest, I would pay for this clasp on its own. Mm. So really, really incredible. This is still to come within this hour, Jewelry Makers. Can we pre-order it? Yes, Sheridan says. Yes, you can. Um, also, we've got this gorgeous strand of multicolored pearls. These are near rounds again, aren't they? We've got three kits, and we're going to have you know we're going to have a, a you know a little bit of a make along. Mm -hmm. um, even the kits go to a clearance price tag. So we're going to have learn how to do a wrap loop. And I know there will be jewelry maker viewers watching right now who are very skilled, and you might be thinking, oh. You're teaching me. You're teaching me the basics. You would be surprised how many people don't know how to do a wrap loop. Mm -hmm. So bear with us. We do a lot of our advanced techniques as well. Um, but yeah, we're going to do that too. Um, so many people have actually messaged, have messaged us on the back of that statement. So there we go. There we go. Um, Sheridan says she's feeling festive. It won't be long. It won't be long. Mm -mm -mm. We can talk about that after... We can talk about the... Yes. No, hang on a minute. If you have got children, which, Laura, you do, <laughs> I, don't tell me you're not saying, look, you've got to be good. Father Christmas is watching. Not yet. You're not saying that? Oh, my gosh. I, I do. I, I am think saying... I, I think I started in February. I am saying, well, we'll add it to your Christmas list mm. because they're at every, they want everything. So it's like, add it to your Christmas list. Yeah. Well, there we go. But yeah. There you go. These are perfect for your, f your festive makes. I'm going to stick with it. I'm sticking with it, you know. <laughs> or you just love this really beautiful deep green. So um, I also have to do this. Ooh. Um. <laughs> Can I have those pearls back? No. They have been cut. So be careful. Give me the big ones. They've also been cut, so be careful. We're making friends in this auction, by right, the way, jewelry makers. There you go. We are making friends. Um, this is an absolute giveaway for these pearls. So don't you think? I mean, look at that. That's it's beautiful. A, it's a gorgeous combination. Lovely. So if you want to get hold of these that. pearls, we've brought them to you. They were the large ones. Um, if you want the, the chrome dioxide, that's still to come. I've got less than 10 of these left. Yeah, literally, this is about making friends. It's not about profit at all. We are a business. We need to make profit. Otherwise, we can't, we can't continue. Um, however, every so often, especially during clearance, um, we will bring you just unmissable opportunities. These are genuine pills. There's nothing wrong with them. You know, it's not like, you know, you know sometimes when you go, to, you go to clothing shops and they might have makeup on it or something like that, so you expect them to be slightly reduced. There's nothing wrong with these. It's just we have got the quant uh, we've got a small quantity um, moving on to 19 I've, I've worked with this before and it is so lovely yeah it's a meter long length don't knot it out don't knot it can I can I do my favorite like a, if you're talking oh, vintage wow. like oh <laughs> hang on <laughs> hold uh, just 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 literally look at this. Look how lovely it is in your hair. Isn't that pretty? I love that. I mean, for your bridal makes and things like that, I'm looking across again at the... Um, I keep forgetting the slide, the vintage <laughs> slide. Yeah, there we go. And there's a lot of this in your vintage jewellery, you know, where mm. it kind of goes around. Um, and you get this, this is all sterling silver, and you've got your cultured pearls, which are approximately an inch apart. 
Um, I've worked with this, it's super easy. So if you wanted to make like opera length earrings, just pop a shepherd hook, open and close. It's probably be a good alternative for the Swarovski if you yes. wanted to switch it up a little bit. Or as well as the Swarovski. Yeah, both. Would you Look like it, that. I've got it here. I, I was looking for it. I mean, you if, you can't find, if you can't find it, the odds are I've got it over here. <laughs> Nine o'clock hour for this Roski. Yeah, look, look at, at that. That's beautiful. Really lovely as a combination. Mm. That's a metre long length of sterling silver chain. For the chain on its own, that's a fabulous deal, right? Um, and we're not stopping there, though, because each of these pearls, of talking those. of wrap loops, look, that's a little tidgy little wrap loop connector. Can you see that? Wrap loop, wrap loop. That's what we're going to master, jewelry makers. Yep. We're going to master how to do this. You can do it. Leah's got confidence in me. Yeah. <laughs> and you've got one of the larger pearls there. Yeah, one of the large pearls there. Oh, beautiful. A metre um, of sterling silver and pearls, like I said, for the chain on its own. So if I just show you the one end, so if I just show you one section, if you took that section there and pop that on a, head, on a, on a shepherd hook, you've just made... You've just made pearl sterling silver earrings. Mm -hmm. Drop earrings. And you could do that this many times over. I mean, there are less than 20 of these within the vault now, Jury Makers. You had your sterling silver findings back or you have it coming your way. I mean, it is absolutely beautiful. The fact even I could wow. work with this, uh, I think it should, should, should be an indication <clears throat> of how beautiful it is. I mean, that, that's such I a mean, lovely bridal bracelet. It's beautiful, and for me, and again, or a hand to wrist if yeah. you wanted to. It also looked really nice if you wanted to um, just have it as a long style necklace. And like you say, maybe if you had a, um, if you had like a focal drop um, pearl mm -hmm. at the bottom, and then maybe have another shorter layered one as well. So pop that clasp onto the end, and you can do that because you've got the two holes there to feed your. Uh, sterling silver wire or hempen mm -hmm. through you've just made a really lovely very 1920s inspired yeah. necklace you know um, at that kind of price for me that sterling silver and pearl all that work's been done because yeah you know even you can rosary link and but to get that consistency and to get it on this fine chain as well it's going to take you such a long time and at that price because you you couldn't charge your price at that no no your time, it's, not, sorry, it's, it's, that it's, price. it's pointless actually trying to make it at that price mm. to yeah, be honest it really is moving on to <coughs> Ooh. So findings pack is coming up straight after this. Then we've got you're going to do the wrap loop. Yeah. And then we're going to do the multicolor pearls. That's it. So many goodies. So many goodies. Beautiful iridescence on these. The more colors spectrums that you see, the more valuable um, the pearl actually is. It's called an iridescence across the surface. And my goodness. This is really offering that iridescence. Can you see those lovely colour spectrum? Now, show you the previous price, jewellery makers. And then we're going to go low. Can you see those lovely colours? That's called iridescence. Oh, my goodness. And some of them are huge, too. Alongside the pearls that we had this morning, most definitely. I know the mid-show had some spectacular pearls as well. Um, with the chrome diopside, absolutely. How about alongside something like... Some vintage zircon. Um, beautiful. Oh, we're dropping that price tag because you are watching on a vintage weekend jewelry makers and there is nothing more classic, more uh, as, as a greater definition of vintage than, than a beautiful pearl necklace. But with a contemporary twist, I think, mm. within these shapes and sizes. Look at that one. That's really drawing my, catching my attention. So $49.95 is already amazing, but if you want it lower... Well, the, the, tonight's tonight is the night. That's what that that's what this evening is all about. Now, listen, we know that we are um, right. The late show sort of competes with, particularly this time of year, some very uh, some very big shows, right? Did 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 did. Guess where producer Tom is right now? I know. Did 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 did. A half past five this morning, he was queuing. That was insane. Yeah. You know, and you're like. I like the show, don't get me wrong. No, I don't know not that I don't think I'd queue for at, at five o'clock in the morning to get there no. and still be there all and then day. And have got all day to sat, yeah, you just know, sat around then just like... Yeah. Um, anyway, but you can record that. I can't guarantee these will still be available um, if you sort of hang <coughs> around and watch a, a little bit later on. £33.25 only. 
Love it. Well done. Well done. Well done. Hold those lines. Okay. Moving on. This is so beautiful. Every, where do I even start? Right, I've shown you the clasp. I'm gonna, I will come back to it, of course. I mean, it is so shop hard. But look at these, you get two of them. So, you know the sterling silver chain that we had earlier on? If you literally th fed one of those sterling silver chains through one of these beautiful pendants, you've just made some very high-end jewelry. Because that, for me, is a feature pendant. Yeah, definitely, that's beautiful. And if I turn it around, you can see you've actually got that double bail. Sorry. Can you see that double bail there? So that, and you get that times two, jewellery makers, times two. There it is. Then we don't just want to give you that. We also want to bring you an 18-inch length of sterling, uh, sorry, silver-plated chain. Then we also want to bring you these absolutely amazing cubic zirconia head pins. So you get one, two, three, four, five, is that right? Yes, five of those head pins, and the length is actually um, 56 millimeters. Mm. You get two pairs <coughs> of your shepherd hooks. You get your crimps, I know I haven't got them here, uh, crimp covers rather, and your crimps. I know I haven't got my crimps on this board, but you do get your crimps. So you get five crimps, you get five crimp covers, you get five jump rings, but for me, the star of the show, is this gorgeous clasp. So the price for the clasp on its own, I think would I, I'd be more, more than happy to pay for this, but you're getting everything. You're getting absolutely everything. I mean, it is the perfect vintage findings pack. 28 pieces in total. <clears throat> That's beautiful, isn't it? Love that. You've got the double drilled either side, uh, sorry, the double um, drill holes there. So that will work with your wire work. Yeah, because I was looking at those and thinking, you know, um, how are you actually going to sort of put your secure material? It. Yeah, secure it. But that's great that it's got those drill holes because if you've got, say, your pearls, they're going to sit nicely in that sort of cup um, finishing. So they're going to look really nice and professional. You could also use it if you did like your Viking knit, you yeah. know, if you wanted to get your pearl knot in, your kumihimos, your sort of, all your sort of materials, you're going to be able to use them for. Will nestle beautifully in there. Yeah. Nine pounds 45. Do you all wow. agree, joy makers, for that clasp on mm. its own? And you can, I said this earlier on about something similar, but you can actually separate these. So that could be a, like an infinity connector. Yeah. And you can use these two to connect into one another if you yeah. wanted to. But if you are, um, I mean, that is just perfection. It's 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 so perfectly Chopard or Parve. Um, so somebody's asking, can you explain how to connect the class? What do you mean, as in attached to it or Let's do it up? Look. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, uh, please could Laura explain how to attach that um, to the clasp? Yeah, no problem. Can I so, have the beading thread out of that? Yeah, by all means. No, I <laughs> like the idea that we're doing this today. So it's very much kind of a very interactive make-along. You, mm. you, you ask the question. We're, okay. keeping, Laura, uh, we're keeping Laura on her toes. <laughs> But you can handle it, Laura, can't yeah. you? Well, you're going to learn with me because this is the first for me as well. So, so here we go. No, I'm going to just... There's some beading thread. Wow, thank you. Yeah, that's how, literally how I unpacked it. So. <laughs> <laughs> you, don't, I'll, I'll, you don't have to use all of that. I'll wind this up. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Um, now, we, we, the crimps are missing from there, aren't they? Yes, they so are missing. That's okay. You I'd... do get crimps, though. You do get yeah, crimps. They just, it's just, just got missed out of there. For some reason. But I have some here because I have many findings. Because you are so, a pro. That's why. There we go. The Laura binding with many findings. <sighs> We've got the threading pack. We can bring this to you. <clears> yeah. Come okay. On, come on. So. Yeah. So I'm shimmy. just going to shimmy over a moment. Mm -hmm. And I'll shimmy this way. So I'm just going to clear myself some space. Okay. There you go. Now I've got these ready for your wrap loops. Oh no. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so... <laughs> um, so I'm going to go ahead and take out a crimp bead. And what I'm going to do is pop one onto my bead and thread. Now obviously I'm just working this out myself, so bear with me. So what I would want to do to see if this works is bring the wire up through, sorry, beading thread. So through one of the holes. Yeah. 
Okay, and then kind of a bit like a wire guardian. I was, you just took the words right out of my mouth. I was thinking that too. Yeah. So, and then back in through the opposite, and then take both of the wires, or sorry, the bead and thread, through the crimp bead, and then feed that up. And you can see that that's gone inside the actual connector just there. Now I'm going to come in, I've got the crimp pliers just here. I'm going to push them right up against it so that they're kind of hidden. So you can see that there. And then if you can see just in there, that's where the crimp bead is. So I'm not going to worry about putting a cover on that one. It's going to be a bit too fiddly and two you shouldn't yeah, see it. Yeah, and it won't be seen. So let's just have a little look and see how one of these lovely pearls. Oh, it's a bit lush, isn't it? It's amazing. Um, and what I'm going to do is just come in and just, just purely because I won't get both of these um, threads going through the pearls. So I'm just pop on one of these pearls. This is the smaller one just because I think it will fit nicer in the size. And then you can just place that there, and there is your finishing. So that would be your next. Can, can I hold that up? You can. Just to show how perfect that is. So I think I would just need to push the crib bead up just a tiny little bit more. That was my mistake. But you can see how that's going to go on there. But you do need to have it a little bit of movement as well, to be honest. Yeah, you don't want it too tight, because otherwise then no. you can't actually articulate the bracelet or necklace, no. can you? So what I'd probably do is maybe put a little bead, a little, one of these little, like a little tiny space bead like this, and then add that pearl, just so that visually you'd see it. But, yeah, and that's how easy it is. That is so... Beautiful. It's beautiful. Love that. Grab that filing pack because honestly, I rave about it every time I see mm. it. Thank you so much, Laura. Yes, okay, sir. right. We're going to do the multicolored pearls, jewelry makers, and then we're going to be a wrap a looping. <laughs> Another near round opportunity and in the pearl or the gemstone world to be truthful what what somebody will perceive and I'm going to be talking about this a little bit more during the tourmaline auction but for example the definition or, or that there's no definitive line between what is a pink sapphire and what is a ruby because basically a ruby is a ruby because it's got slightly uh, more chromium within the actual gemstone. They start at the same gem. The same applies when it comes to your, your, your tourmaline, if you like. I'll explain a little bit more a little bit later on. But we're always very, very cautious, or we should be very cautious when saying that something is, you know, there's... One more example. Have you ever noticed there's no A, B or C in the diamond world? They start... They start from D, don't they? And that's because you never know. You never, and that's a worldwide grading system. You never actually know if there is an A, B, or C. So they actually start from D. That's the best. So in pearls, and you might be thinking right now, get to the point. In pearls, we always globally are quite cautious to say a perfect spherical pearl. You know, a flawless pearl, for example, because... These are an organic material, and if I mean I, there are techniques that you can marry, uh, you can actually um, determine just how beautiful, beautifully 360 it is. But most of it is actually done with the naked eye. So this is a near pearl, and to be truthful, that is not far off as good as it gets. To be honest, you can get spherical pearls, but they are fortunes and fortunes. But very few jewelers would actually say that because. Like I said with your diamonds, you don't know. You actually don't know if that is actually the case. So this is up there with some of the best shape of pearls that you could possibly get. Now, these have got a mixture of multicolors that are completely natural that will have reflected the colors of the inside of your mollusk itself. Um, these are very high luster, so like the white pearls that you had just previously, um, they're very sort of mirror-like reflection. We're not talking about internal brilliance or anything like that, or clarity because they're not diamonds, um, or any of your other transparent gemstones. It's all about that surface luster. Saying that, you have got really beautiful blemish-free pearls 
oils here, so very, very few pits and indentations. So much like our skin jewelry makers, you get the odd characteristics, let's put it that way. Um, you know, and the same applies within your pearls. These are high quality, near round. You've got about 50 pairs of pearl earrings if you wanted to. You've got, sorry, 25 pairs of pearl earrings, 50 pearls. Um, and we're at 45 pounds and 95 pence, which is just amazing considering these are natural color. If you think about colored pearls, and you might be thinking, well, does the white command a higher price tag? Not really, it's all in the eye of the beholder. I've got an Okoya pearl, which is very golden. Uh, South Sea pearls are very golden. They are very, very expensive normally. I've got a great deal on mine. Um, but to be truthful, you wouldn't be able to tell the difference between the pearls that you've got here and the one that I'm just describing. We're going to take it to the lowest ever price jewellery makers, the lowest ever price. And it, oh my goodness. So to be truthful, each of these pearl strands that we've actually had this evening, I think could command a triple figure price tag. That would be what my perceived value, if you like, would be of this kind of caliber, this kind of quality. It takes just very simple, basic jewelry making techniques, you know, sort of uh, restranding. You know, you saw how simple it was for Laura to attach that clasp using just a crimp, uh, literally a crimp. That's it. Feed on your pearls, on some beading thread, and that is it. It's done. You've just made yourself some very high jewelry. We've got a threading pack coming your way as well if you're just getting started in the world of jewelry making so if you've never ever made a single piece of jewelry text him we are live here in the studio so if you need to know any techniques we're not even stopping there jewelry makers so um, we have to put a little bit of a curfew on it though so you've got a minute to win it at this price tag it's Sheridan you know what she's like jewelry makers she's not afraid to bring you the ultimate clearance price tag um, yeah, so honestly, I tune into a lot of Sheridan shows because I know as a member of staff, even we can't get them at prices like this sometimes. Wow. For 50 near round pearls, and natural near round pearls. And multicolored as well, so that's great because that means that, you know, you can pair up different colors so you've got your peach you've got your lavender you've got your cream you know you've even got your like mocha kind of tones yeah, there have, haven't yeah. you yeah, so you've got such a variety there that you can make do you, like you say if you want to make earrings you can just make pairs of different colored earrings great for bridesmaids again great for weddings I think they're brilliant. They're amazing. And I think that price tag straight away is perfect. You know, all you need to do is pop like a head pin through the centre, yep. a little bit of your jewelry making glue, cut it down, use your butterfly bats. You've just made some pearl stud earrings. Mm -hmm. And that takes seconds seconds to do um so literally down to the final few seconds at this price tag you have to check them out coming up right are you ready because we are wrap looping Now, whilst we are up looping, we're going to put the threading pack onto your screen because these are essentials. Um, anybody that is a jewellery maker and has been for any length of time knows we've never changed these, never ever changed our Essentials threading pack and I don't think we ever should because the beading thread is amazing, the monofilament in there which creates like an illusion setting, it's a little bit like your wildfire so it's completely transparent and you've got elastic in there for your stretchy bracelets so um, we're going to bring these onto your screen, comes in the chiffon bag there so can you see, there's your beading thread which is that lovely sort of silvery colour, then you've got, that's your elastic, this one here, so that's one millimeter gauge uh, elastic and this one's monofil monofilament so it, it's great for seed beading and your finer much much finer gemstones as well necklaces. yeah illusion styles yeah beautiful you can even crochet with it three pounds only now laura said to me l i will get you to master the the wrap loop and i have to say i haven't got confidence because I am so bad at wrap looping i i, I, I confession jewelry makers i bring my <laughs> My wrap loops in for whichever guest designer is on to do it for me. That's what I actually do. Confession time. So if you reckon I can achieve this. I reckon you can achieve this. Okay, go on then. Okay. But I'm glad I'm not the only one, so thank you for messaging in. Um, and if we can do this, um, maybe a bit later on or at some point, I'll show how the briolette wrap as well, because that also crosses over with the wrap loop. Okay. So... I've already prepared a featherweight head pin for you. Thank you. Okay, so this is a nice, easy, thin wire for you. All right. So oh, I'm not demoing. I am going to try, You're but don't try. follow me on camera. <laughs> don't, even don't put pressure. Right. 
<laughs> Sherry, I think you should come and do a rap learning. Yeah. Oh, so oh, oh, I've, got, I've got a job to do, you know. Okay. <laughs> right, so you can use my rhino's pliers. Okay. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you, because I've only got one pair of rhinos, so I'm going to explain. Okay. So when you're going to do a wrap loop, okay, when we do a wrap loop onto an earring, mm -hmm. what I'm going to do is come in with my pliers yep. and I'm coming just enough down the pliers that I can actually grip and hold this securely because if I'm too close to the end, it's more likely to slip. Okay. Okay. Um, obviously, also, go looking at the size of my pliers, the depth that I'm about to push this wire back is actually going to determine the gap underneath it. Okay. So I'm just going down there and just bending that wire so it just... It's facing away, so can you see that? Yeah. Now, a lot of people, when we do this, I go, do I push it away or towards me? It doesn't matter. Okay. Right? Whatever feels comfortable. Okay. So then I'm going to just open my pliers and switch my hand so that my pliers are now repositioned. Upwards. Upwards. So I've got this prong here, and what I'm going to do is take this wire and place it over. Okay. Okay. So you've kind of got like a coat hanger effect. Yeah, it's almost like a shepherd hook. Yeah. Take your pliers back out, reposition it again. So every time my motion so is very minimal. So this is where I get in a fuddle. And I can tell you I know how and why. We're going to fix it. Okay. So I've got this area underneath here is nice and clear. You can see that I'm using the pliers almost like a vice. I'm putting all my pressure into the pliers. I'm not affecting this. Okay. okay? So what I expect you do is your, your wire comes down. Mm. Yeah. So what you want to do is take that wire. I'm going to call it a wire. And it's a head pin. Um, and what you want to do is almost hit the bottom of the pliers. Okay. Okay? So you almost want to pull that wire up. Okay. Okay? And then you just rotate it around. And again, just pull it up a little bit because what will happen is a lot of people do that. So yeah, if I you think I'm doing bring that, that well. wire around like that. Somebody else mentioned they're doing that. Okay. Then when you take that out, that's going to be a nice wrap. Mine is never going to look like that. It is. I bet it is. Hi, Liz. Laura, I'm struggling with my wire wrapping. Uh, my tension is not great, um, either too tight or too loose. Uh, can you suggest a simple wrap that is easy, please? Right, okay, that's a different technique. Okay. So we'll get to okay, that. I'll plan that into the second demo. Okay. Okay. Perfect. So, there's my round nose pliers. I'm actually scared. So, I'm actually going to do this with you, because you'll be fine. I'm going to use non-round pliers, so this will be... More tricky for me. Okay. Uh, let me find a photo. So, right. Don't look so scared, you're fine. I actually am quite scared. Right. Because I'm so bad at it. So, that's it, you're doing good. Is it, this feels so awkward though, like this. That's it. Well, how does it feel comfortable for you? If you were to do this, how would you look naturally... my hands. Yeah, but... <laughs> right. My hand's really awkward. No. Because right. why, why am I not comfortable like because that? Because you're holding it like this, right? Lean forward. Mm. Okay, yeah, it's better. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to do that. Just and relax. And I will yeah. say this: oh, anyone who's been to my workshop, now. everybody knows. I always like relax, relax. Because if you're like this, straight away it reflects in your work. Okay. Whereas yeah, if you I'm sit tense. and you relax, okay. and then put your hand down, just relax. <laughs> Not that much. <laughs> okay. Um, and Ooh, now, oh, it's moved. Hang on. That's okay. Don't panic. That's it. Pop your pliers. Come down a bit. A bit further down. That's it. Okay. Now, relax. Push it. That's it. Stop. Yeah. Reposition your pliers. So take your pliers out and then reposition them. Like that? However feels comfortable. But yeah, you want it, the pliers to be like that. And now take that wire. Yeah. And remember to bring it all the way around the bottom of the pliers, but remember to try and almost pull the wire up slightly. Slightly. That's it. Almost hit the bottom of the pliers. Okay, well, right, all already I'm a bit wonky, woo. No, you're not. That's it. Pull it up. That's it. And then straighten. And then bring round. And then again. So another little tip that you can do as well is... So Take your pliers, take some chain those pliers if it's tricky to grab the wire yeah. and use your pliers. Oh gosh, now you're, now you're asking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not left handed. You know, what hand did I hold it in? I held that my, my right hand. Yeah, or well, don't, or do, put it, if it's struggling with the pliers, put the pliers down. Or switch your hands. Switch them. Okay. Because all you're doing is using your hand as a vice to switch it. Still wonky. Let me have a look. Um, that is not wonky. Right. 
Look. Now, put your pliers Donna, back in. I've got a wonky one too. No, no you haven't. <laughs> right. Let me... Right. Tell me, is that wonky? You just straightened that, though. No, I didn't. All I did was that. Okay. And I put my pliers in. That is not... No, you've 100% adjusted not, that. I have not. I literally, all I did was put my pliers in and do that. That's all I did. Okay. Promise you, I wouldn't do that. Oh, I tell you what, I tell you what, that was tense, that was. I genuinely felt <laughs> I a little bit My stressful. pliers are, like, hot. But you've been, Live like... television <laughs> is nothing in comparison to a rap loop in my world. But, honestly. look at that. <laughs> honestly. Well, Donna, I hope that helped you. And everybody else that's been having the same issues as me. And I like the fact that here at Jewelry Maker, we will do that. You know, I've, I've, I've been dabbling in jewellery making since mm -hmm. 2011. I've still... That's very much been my Achilles heel. I wouldn't say I've mastered it. But it is, it is a lot better. Now, can I just say, I need to show you these pills, sorry. So whilst I've been wrap, I'll wrap a loop in. Um, <laughs> half the stock of these has gone already. So look at how beautiful that pink is. Amazing. Oh, I feel like I need another little lie down now. I'm gonna, get you, after that. I'm gonna get you to do another one in the oh break. Oh god, no, don't do I am. Eight ninety five for genuine pink pearls. Potato pearls, they've got those really beautiful kind of organic, almost like an oval shape. That's natural colour that you're looking at here. Hello Francois, hello Valerie, hello to you, Melissa, London Debbie, best ever deal on these hands down. You've got to check them out though. Julie, Sandra, County, Durham, those of you on the phone lines, come and text in. If you've got any Achilles heels that you have in jewelry making and you want Laura to help you out with them <laughs> then message us um, um i love the elastic in your threading packs i know me too yeah me too that's like a pound each for each of those yeah, threading packs brilliant. you get loads out of that threading pack i do too um, am i allowed can i can i confession confession i'll say it once i love our elastic the most <gasps> dun, dun, dun. do you adam yeah adam say the same yeah, I love it the most. I actually think it's the best elastic. I it's reckon that you'll have um, a, a, um, a challenge one day where you have, like, you, maybe the producer and the, the designer, no, the general, um, all make an elastic bracelet, a stretchy bracelet, see who can do it the quickest. Oh, yeah. I like that. Challenge yeah. day. Yeah? Are you going to have a go? <laughs> yeah? Sure. Smash it, he said, Adam's going to smash it. Right, okay, yeah, that's Jeremy's, it. We'll I've make got sure everything in 19, what's 19? Is it this one? Do you want to show me a picture? Oh no! Six by eight millimetres rice bead pearls. Nine, did you say? I thought you said 19. <laughs> Nine, okay, sorted. <sighs> right, fast place auctions. Pretty tough for that. Right then. Should we do, should we do um, you know, um, and how many auction challenge? Ten ninety five, and that's not your price tag for beautiful white, color, uh, white fresh water, genuine natural pearls. These will be beautiful with all the pearls that I've brought you already. You are fifteen minutes away from your one to own. Look at that as a combination. Why six ninety five? Yeah, I've got to shift up a gear, haven't I? Or is it down a gear to go faster? I don't know. Thirty eight centimeter strand here. Uh, thank you, Laura. I've been doing my wrap wrap loop wrong. You're not well, the only yeah, one. Let me, let me know if that works because that's the best way I found. People pull the wire down, and that's how you get that kind of Wonk. movement. Yeah, see, so and it bunches. There you go, there you go. Debbie. There you go. You got to pull the wire up, <laughs> <laughs> but then straighten it. Oh, then straighten it. So just slightly up, then straighten. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. I'm going to be doing this in my sleep now. Up forward. Let me adjust. <laughs> The You're going to be using that voice as well. We adjust. Pull the wire up. <laughs> and straighten. And, and straighten. straighten. And up. And straighten. Like a dance move. It's great. Yeah, we've just invented our own dance <laughs> move. Um, did you say 17? Seven. Seven, seven, seven. Come on. Okay, here you go. This would be lovely with those pink pearls that you had earlier on. I mean, that's such a mother of the bride, classic combination. And colour, you know, lots of the uh, sort of eras that we're talking about, we're not shy in using um, sort of high impact colours, were they? Um, so I've got kits to bring you, and we are bringing them at clearance price, but they're going to be fairly on and gone, jewellery makers, so, because I want to squeeze in as many as we, opportunities as we possibly can within this hour. So 15 minutes, yeah, auction challenge. 
Six pounds and twenty-five pence, but we kind of got to work together here. Go, 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 go! <laughs> Nora's just there minding her own business, like, what is she going on about? Okay, so how about some more gorgeous pearls? Any classic ivory pearls? Um, I don't know what number that was. Seven. There you go. Oh, these are lovely. You've got some here which have got almost like a droplet shape. Yeah, I mean, these have got that droplet shape, so they're not near rounds. They're definitely, definitely not near rounds, and you can see there's the, the description potato, whilst not, not the most beautiful. Um, and I, I would change that if I had the power and ability to change the entire term of uh, term of potato pearls. Um, however, it's a highlight that it's, got, it's sort of a more organic shape. Look at where we're starting at. Um, but we're going to put that 60-second clock onto your screen. So some of these have got really lovely drop shapes. Um, are you ready? They are not shell pearls. And the reason why we're saying it, because that price tag, you'd, you'd almost expect that they were shell pearls, wouldn't you? I mean, they're beautifully smooth, that nacre surface. Seven by nine millimeters. Well done already, lots of you there. Hello to you, Manchester, Dorset, Gwyneth, you're there as well. Nice and nice and quickly on the phone lines. I've got, I keep, I keep seeing these strands of sapphires. Oh, wow. They'd be rather lovely, wouldn't they, in between? Wow, wow, wow. Shall we do a DVD on how to make your pearl jewellery next? Um, <laughs> you've got to... I'm allowed to say it now, aren't I? I'm allowed to say it. So I hate this this picture that you're about to see. I absolutely hate <laughs> it. And the reason for, for that is because it always reminds me of Joey Tribbiani, our friends with his smell of <laughs> fart acting. <laughs> You need to give a warning before you say that. <laughs> Hold those phones. <laughs> Adam's doing a really good one. Come here, Adam. Do you smell the fire? <laughs> Come on, Adam. Come on. Come on. We'll do it together. We'll do it together. We'll both do our best. Joey Tribbiani. Smell the fart acting. So you ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> ready? Hold on. <laughs> It just looks really dodgy because I'm sat here and you're both like that. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> okay, here you go. Are you ready? Oh. Are you ready? I was less hysterical at the time. <laughs> Oh, I hate this picture, but anyway, <laughs> see where I'm coming from? <laughs> it's the definite smell of fart acting, isn't it? <laughs> oh, gee, me. Uh, how to make, it's also the Jamaican pose, isn't it? You know, find something over there and just stare at it, even if it's not there. Um, okay, so this is actually an hour-long DVD, approximately, and it teaches you how to make beautiful pearl jewelry. Um, if you look at, I'm going to turn this round. If you look at that at the bottom there, sorry, I hate that picture even more. Um, at the bottom there, you've actually got sort of lots of techniques to how you actually use your tools, the genuine pearl necklace and classic pearl bracelet. It's awful. We need it's to see all of this, though. We need to. Move your hand. <laughs> Move your hand. No. Move your and then, hand. And then you've got. Let's see the picture. And then you've got your BDB pearl Aww. necklace and that loop. Um, <sighs> use this as my Facebook yeah. profile picture. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it is very. Good, the DVD. Um, yeah, it is really good. So it teaches you some really beautiful essential. So you know we've, we have. I'm, I'm crying here. You know you've got your introduction to jewelry maker DVD for your wrap loops and things like that. This is your great introduction to making pearl jewelry. It includes you know sort of pearl designs, bead beads with pearls, wrap loops with pearls, etc., etc. So well done. Moving on. Um, okay, the three kits. We're doing that next. Okay, which one first? With rhodochrosite, that oh, rhodochrosite. That's usually quite an expensive gemstone, and yet we're bringing it in clearance. Um, rhodochrosite, as the name would suggest, you've got a lovely rose colour. 
Um, and if you speak to gemologist Marie, she loves rhodochrosite. Um, often forms in stalactites and stalagmites. Um, here we go. Um, if you if you heard, I think it was during the the, the birthday back in May. Um, yeah, rhodochrosite was. We had pairs, perfect pairs. They were described of. They, they literally matched one another. It was very expensive, um, but absolutely worth every single penny of them. So that's natural pink. Isn't it a really beautiful gemstone? Natural pink. Yeah, it's a lovely, lovely treasure. And it can be very expensive, as I said, because it mm. forms... Where is it from? Is it Argentina? I thought so. Many of the rhodochrosites, and I can't say for certain, is actually found in stalactites and stalagmites, which make... If you were with me with Alex on, on, what, on Tuesday, was it? Um, he was actually saying... Any gemstone found in stalactites and stalagmites are very expensive because of the rarity of them. Um, you're not just getting that, though. You're also getting the multicoloured shell wheels, and you're getting the 30 metres of wire, which is in your 0.4, your 0.8, and your 1 millimetre. Um, I mean, look at these gorgeous designs that Laura has created. So I've done, what, I've done one piece with this because I had a couple of kits. So okay. I've done just one piece just to show you um, just how you can use this. Look at that. And you've got some really big rhodochrosite yeah, in there. Yeah, beautiful. Um, and what's really lovely about this as a cabochon is, and I, I'll often say this, when you're working with cabochons, especially when you're sort of beginning with cabochons, uh, <laughs> um, they've got... <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, Laura. <laughs> you shouldn't be saying, you should be saying sorry. <laughs> I'm still doing the... Yeah, carry on. Carry on. Um, because of the um, the texture of the gemstone, it's got almost quite like a waxy kind of feel. Yeah. So it really grips the wire really nicely. So it makes working with it really easy. They're also quite a nice shallow gemstone as well, which means yeah. that you, you don't need to do a lot of work to them. They are absolutely stunning. And when you get transparency, with Argentinian rhodochrosite, you can, yeah, you can pay a, a very high yeah. price tag for them. Now, the cabochons on their own have actually been brought to air at, what was it, £20? Yeah, well, that's more than amazing for rhodochrosite. Um, for me, I would happily pay £41.25 for the rhodochrosite on its own. You get these really lovely shell wheels too, plus the 30 metres of your um, essential gauges of wire. Are you ready for your clearance price, jewellery makers? The beautiful designs. We'll, look, of course, upload photographs. Um, it's a gemstone that works beautifully with wire work. A what reduction? A 44% reduction for you. 44%. I mean, you know, most clearance in retail, you're talking 10, 20 percent. They might say, oh, 70 percent off. But can you ever find that 70 percent off item? Because wow. I never can. Twen so you are get you're buying the road across site, really, and you're getting pretty much everything yeah. else for free. That is awesome. And I mean, obviously, I've gone gem heavy. I've made sort of the whole necklace with the, the rondelles as well. I mean, you could just use chain. You could make more roses. I mean, I have also done sort of two more rose designs next to it. And again, you, these gemstones, this cut and, and the cabochon and the sort of the, um, the wheels go across all of the designs. Yeah, so yeah. you could do them in any kind of color way. And they just complement because within the road across site you've got those lovely earthy tones. Um, so we've got three kits to bring you. They are all sort of similar sort of shapes, um, shapes and sizes, just alternating gemstones. Don't forget that picture. You do get the shell as well. So which one next? Botswana. Yeah, I think it's that one. <gasps> That's Botswana. Yeah, it's beautiful. Look at the colour of this Botswana. I almost didn't believe Sheridan then when she said it. And look how much you get. Alongside your unicite and your wire, show you the should be price. Look at that Botswana. I mean, how often do you see Botswana with that lovely mm. kind of pinkish colour? Okay. We're all we're running out of time. We've got another we've got another kit to squeeze in, so we have to be quite quick. Carol, Michelle, well done. Look at that lovely Botswana agate. So we should be at forty one pounds seventy five. Now Botswana, how many carrots am I getting here? And it's called Rosie, so you get a natural red Botswana. <clears throat> two hundred and forty two carrots in your Botswana, which is natural. You get your unikite strand, which is how many carrots in the unikite? 60 carats in these lovely wheels, plus the three gauges of your wires, which is 0 0.4, 0 0.8, and your one mil. Another, wow. what was it, 44% wow. reduction. 
I mean, that's a big saving. Yeah, you've got all of those um, cabochons there. You get loads with this. And then, obviously, you've got the, the inner kite as well, which is a lovely gemstone. Very yeah. underrated, I think. The, yeah, you almost get, like, a quintessential English country garden yeah. in a gemstone, don't you? Ah, it is. Actually, quite autumnal. Yeah. I, I, I didn't know Botswana came in such a red colour. No, it's beautiful, isn't it? And I love, you've also got some sort of plummy tones in there. You've just mm -hmm. got a lovely mix, and it's, it does make you think autumnal kind of tumbling roses. It's, yeah. Plummy. Plummy. <laughs> plummy tones. <laughs> <laughs> lovely plummy tones. You can tell us a wine drinker, can't you? <laughs> Loops of love plum. that channel out. So did you, Katarina, <laughs> Rosemary, Carol, you're there as well. Well done. Um, I've got one more to auction to squeeze in. I think you're going to absolutely adore um, to adore <laughs> this kit as well. But, you know, we had a message the other evening, uh, last evening I worked, and some I forget who it was, so she said, oh, Elle, I like it when you do the late show because you just go really <laughs> random. <laughs> and I do, I know. That's why they don't let me out at night that often. <laughs> Especially when you've been in on the morning as well. Christine, I don't know if you're laughing with me or at me. Either way, I'm fine with that. I'm absolutely yeah. down with that. It was it the smell the fart act acting. <laughs> <laughs> Adams is really good. It's really scarily good. <laughs> yeah, the way you float, you flay your nostrils as well. It's really good. Um, <laughs> okay, here you go. Here you go. Here you go. So the gauges of your wire. This is in the rose gold. So you got your one mil, your point eight, and also your point four. Um, lovely rose quartz wheels. Yeah. And this is the one I've done the two other necklaces with as well. But I think my favourite of all the cabochons. Pair, these yeah, pre -nights. I absolutely love these and I love this kit I think it's one of my favorites it's my kind of color tone isn't it you've yeah. got your rose gold you've got the rose quartz you've got the um, pre night I just think it's beautiful and again it lends itself perfectly for the designs pre night is this really lovely kind of fresh green isn't yeah it? and that's completely natural 21.95 and again I mean look so how yeah, beautiful so, sort of... so you made this 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 fabulous so, um, yeah, this... wire work collar here oh look at that Amazing. We are running out of time, jewelry makers. Keep those text messages coming through because we can have having like a little bit of a make along show. Um, so this hour is all about two very special strands. Now we have got the beautiful Russian chrome diopside coming your way. Um, in nuggets with that beautiful natural green but another natural treasure and one that I tell you what literally my jaw hit the floor when I saw this strand I was like oh my goodness I've never seen that before how have I never seen it before because I learned then that it'd been in the vault for some time and that upsets me because it, I kind of think this is too beautiful and we've got too many collectors out there that deserve to own this gemstone so these two amazing gemstones are coming your way as your must have Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. I'm going to put my very Porsche's voice on to tell you to join us this weekend for our fabulous vintage event. We have 50 brand new Pearl products that you are going to be mesmerized by. 
Some of your favourite guest designers included in that is Fleur, Alison, Jan and more. Pearl deal of the days on both Saturday and Sunday. There's a gorgeous Russian Amazonite bundle. The most tantalising Murano glass. So do join us here at Jewelry Maker for the Vintage Weekend. Our brand new Get Started with Jewelry Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewelry making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewelry designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash get started with JM where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewelry making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewelry making journey. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Hi, guest designer Hannah Osborne here. I'd love you to join me on this Sunday mid-show for the return of the most amazing Murano glass beads. I've got some of my favourite colours coming back and I've got four kits with matching seed beads to go with all of them. So join me on Sunday the 22nd for the mid-show as part of the Vintage Weekend. You can watch our Jewelry Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right hand corner of our homepage. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewellery making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Maker course gift vouchers are now available. You can choose from a bronze, silver or gold voucher. Each voucher is worth a different amount that entitles you to book towards a course of your choice. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our Jewelry Maker community is a fantastic platform to share, learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people? This next strand simply had to be of a must-have status. Um, the moment, clearly, and I know I've repeated myself here, um, but 
The moment that I saw this strand of tourmaline, literally my jaw hit the floor. I've never brought it to air personally myself. And I thought, and I think frankly, the fact that it is still within our vault is an absolute sacrilege. Um, because this is incredible, incredible quality. Now, tourmaline is a gemstone which is greatly misunderstood, I think, particularly here in the UK market. But if you go outside of the UK, it can, and it does, fetch huge prices per carat of, of, of quality, which this, I personally think, is without shadow of a doubt, amazing, amazing quality. Um, and I said to Sheridan, listen, Sheridan, because listen, Sheridan has a, had her reservations about this strand. Um, initially, she was like, Elle, you, you chrome dioxide you must have, and, I'm, I'm, and it is still your must have, but I think this need deserve to be in that same league, if you know where I'm, where I'm coming from. And she didn't have her reservations about the, ca the, the quality, but she was saying, Elle, it's been on air before, and, and my exact words were, I haven't brought this to air before, and I truly, truly want our jewellery makers to have this. It's too spectacular to be within our vault, to be honest. So um, the discussion that Adam Sheridan and I had actually in the, in the, in the production room this, uh, this evening was, OK, so how about if I said to our viewers, listen, if I can guarantee that all 79 of these go, and I can re remember even from five o'clock this afternoon, how many we actually have available. If every single one of that 79 go, that I promise that we'll take it to an ultimate clearance price, but as long as we guarantee that every single one of them go, um, with the understanding, um, with the understanding that you all recognize that this price tag is no reflection, categorically no reflection of the true value or worth. So I did a little bit of research on pink tourmaline. It's a gemstone that we don't often get to speak about here. Um, and like I said, it can be quite misunderstood. If you go to USA, not at all. That's a gemstone, which this is one of the highest of sort of value gemstones over there. And it is here too. It's just maybe we're a little bit slow on the uptake. Um, so here it is. Now, this is obviously a little bit of the strand because Laura has been very lucky and has already been working with it. So this is um, a natural, genuine gemstone. That color is all Mother Nature's doing. And it has fascinated the world, um, the gemstone world, for thousands upon thousands of years. Now, Turamali, which basically means the gem of mixed stones, um, is a gemstone which has a very unique ability. Firstly, it can actually attract particles, which is known as pyroelectricity. Um, and when tourmaline is actually heated or rubbed, they can actually create an electrical charge. I mean, how amazing is that? Early observers believe that this gemstone, with its wide array of colours, because you can get pink tourmaline, blue tourmaline, yellow tourmaline, green tourmaline, you can get all different varieties, colourless tourmaline, but they actually believed that this gem, that the colours were thanks to it being um, basically passing over a rainbow, rainbow, and whilst it did that, it absorbed all of those wonderful magical shades. But, like I touched on this earlier on, there's a bit of a debate between what is a pink sapphire and what qualifies it to be a ruby. It's much the same discussion when it comes to tourmaline. Tourmaline is pink tourmaline, and when does it actually become rubelite? Now, we've labelled this as pink tourmaline, and I think we've been quite conservative in that labeling because I, there are definite rubelites, in my opinion, within that strand. So, a rubelite technically speaking, and this is the only classification for it, is uh, it becomes a rubelite when it maintains a deep pink red colour in both daylight and auto, also artificial light. Well, here in, the stu here in the studio, this is artificial light. Do you see pink and red colour? Most definitely. Pink and red. I mean, that one here is surely a rubelite right there. It doesn't mention at any point clarity or any of those things. A tourmaline is expected to have internal inclusions because it is what we call a type three gemstone. Under um, um, natural light, you're gonna see even more of those pink and reds. Um, this is a gemstone which is far, far, far rarer than your rubies and your sapphires. This is a gemstone which commands a far, far higher price tag in, in most cases than your rubies and your sapphires in actual fact. It is a gemstone which 
it is considered, in my opinion, the top three of all tourmalines. The pinks, your blues, and your your kind of steely blues as well, that kind of indicolite colour, um, are the ones that command the highest price tag. And it is such a shame that this has been within the vault up until now. But um, I, get, I, said to, I said to you earlier on, didn't I, Sheridan, if we can guarantee that all 79 of those go, you know, can we do something just a little bit special as this evening's must have? And she said, OK. Uh, she's given us a clearance deal. I mean, we, we, as, there is already a clearance deal. Um, and let me just show you what that price is. It's previously closed considerably higher than what you are about to see right now. In fact, that price tag previously was $79.95, which, to be truthful, is already an amazing price for this level and this quality. But what do you reckon, jury makers? Do you reckon every single one of these is going to sell this evening? I really hope so, because I know I can say this, hand on heart, if there's one of them left within the vault come the end of the, uh, the, end of this show, I'll be all over it, because I don't own a rubelite, and I would absolutely love to own a rubelite, or pink tourmaline, whichever one you, way you want to actually classify it as. There's some here which are definitely pink tourmaline, but there's some here which are definitely your rubelite, in my opinion. This is completely and utterly natural, but we will go lower um, if we work together. So uh, what, what do you say? What do you say? Must have? How about if I also show how to wrap one? Yes. So I tell you what, we are going to go as low as oh, <clears throat> half the stock, as in 50% of the stock being allocated this evening. This is Sheridan's price. And, and, and uh, listen, 79.95 was his previous closing price. If 50% of the stock goes this evening, this next price tag is just amazing. Use this with your precious sterling silver. We've got that for you, jewelry makers. Categorically, this is the best deal that you've had on a strand like this. You do get more than what's on your strand because Laura has actually been well, busy. You, well, I'm wearing a pair of earrings. You've got five in each ear. Oh, my goodness. So there's ten in Pink your earrings. Rings. And then I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. About nine here plus the strand. Well, one of these, okay, just to, I mean, forty nine ninety five. If you were to find a pink tourmaline in gold, I'm going to say gold because it is a gemstone that normally is in gold. You would never in a million years find it at a d double figure price tag. No, and no. I'm talking about one of those stones, just one of them. Yeah, I mean, I've used the smaller ones in your earrings and that I've got here. You can see I haven't actually touched, touched. the larger of the German stones, and they are absolutely beautiful. Like, I love the colour, the way that you've got some light, some dark, and I think it's just, they're stunning. Adam, what did you just say? Google the price per carat for pink tourmaline. Even the lowest grade, which these clearly aren't, just proves how amazing this price is on your screens right now. $400 per carat for even the lowest wow. of grades. So can you see now, jewelry makers, wow. why I was so excited and passionate about this very strand? I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this. If there are two strands that you treat yourself to this evening, let it be this one and let it be the chrome dioxide because they are unbelievable deals. Already, Elvina, Katerina, Anne, Celia, Mary, Michelle, Judy, new customer, welcome. Sarah, uh, Sue, Sarah, and the Channel Isles, you're all there. I don't want to send a single one of these back to the vault because they are just too, too gorgeous. Too gorgeous at that price tag. I've got sterling silver wire if you want to complete it with that precious metal, which, to be honest, I think it would be absolutely sacrilege um, if you didn't use your precious metal, such as the calibre of the gemstone. We've just said the lowest grade, even the lowest grade, which these aren't, a, a 400, pa 400 US dollars, sorry, per carat. Look how many carats you're getting in this one strand. So how many, how many did you use in, in each earring? Five in each earring. So that's ten in your earrings. There. Oh. And they weren't... Um, do you want me to count them quickly? Yeah. Look at um, those. So... You tell me, you tell me, jewellery makers, are they not ruby-like colours? Because I would definitely say they are. 
Okay, so there's... They've got that rich, intense They have pink really, red. they really have. They're beautiful. And I can see in the light here, it, they're really glowing. Oh. So there's 20 left on the strand. Um, and I, as I said, I went for like the sort of the smaller of the earring, uh, the, the gemstones. And then I've got another nine on my mat. And these are the smaller ones because I sort of went about a, um, four in from the end for the earrings. I've just picked up one, and this is by no means the biggest. It's actually one yeah, of the smallest. the smallest. Look at that. Look at that. An, an average across the strand is 71 points in each of your tourmalines. Crazy. And we're going lower. We're going lower, but I want you to get these home. It would be a real shame if just, if, even if there was just one left over, well, I'd get it. I would definitely get it, definitely. Check out those baskets, because this is truly amazing. 44.95 jewelry makers for that beautiful intensity, that natural color. Um, you know, the fact that, like I said earlier on, there's a much, there's a debate between oh, what qualifies a, a pink sapphire as a pink sapphire and a ruby as a ruby. It's in the eye of the beholder jewelry makers. That's the difference. It's from one, it's one gemologist saying, well, I, I call that a ruby, I call that a sapphire. Fire. The same applies when it comes to your tourmaline. You know, what is the difference between a pink tourmaline and a rubellite? It's in the eye of the beholder. It's how intense those gorgeous pink red colors. But, you know, we use this expression. If you can see those red, uh, those pink red colors by both daylight and artificial light, then it's classed as a rubellite. That takes it to a whole other ball game and a whole other price tag than the ones that we've been mentioning. I've got 40 of these left. Please don't let me send if these back. I, I, they're too beautiful. And I think any of our um, it, there's a bit of a queue on the phone line, so do bear with us. Our call centre will be with you shortly. Jill, Sarah, Celia, Mary, Michelle, new customer, Sue, Sarah, and Channel Ars. Check out those baskets. Stay where you are on those phone lines. I need to move on because we've got another must-have to bring you, and I've got loads more to bring you as well. But um, I, I will take a little look at the end of at the end of the hour, and if there's any of them left, then I'll be all over it. Now, somebody's asking where do we get the Swarovski from? That's coming up in the nine o'clock hour. You can pre-order it now. It's actually, it's not classed as your cup chain. What's this, a channel set? Yes, I think so. So you get a 50 centimetre length. And Laura's actually, channel chain, there we go. And Laura's actually used just a section in the top of these earrings. I mean, aren't they stunning? Oh, wow, 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 wow. Um, so, yeah, you can pre-order these now, but if not, if you want to do it by live auction, they're coming up in the 9 o'clock hour. Okay, a double must-have. And we've had so many of you messaging about this, but must-have too. Um, because... Diopside forms all around the world, but if you want the best and you want the most expensive, the most valuable, I say expensive, not this evening, then it's, it's the Russian mine. So, um, but there are rumors that that mine has actually now closed. I'm always very hesitant to say it definitely has because you never know. Um, this is one of the few strands that we have within our entire vault jewelry makers, and this is natural color. I mean, it's often referred to as the million dollar emerald because this is, I mean, an emerald would only, uh, only wish long um, to look like this. It's much uh, more highly refractive. What that means is it gives you a lot more light performance. You are getting a full 86 centimeters, possibly even more than that, at twelve pounds ninety five we've probably got less than I reckon this many strands of chrome dioxide within our entire vault, this being one of them jewelry makers it's very very scarce. Our buying team so yeah, I'd say less than ten within our entire vault I can't put together a showcase for you because there's not enough of it basically our be um, our wonderful buying team will have definitely had this on the radar um, whenever they go to uh, some locations like Hong Kong or um, China when they go to places, you know, those kind of, those gem fairs, this will be on their radar. Very, not always do they come away successful. Um, these have, uh, we've actually managed to reorder this, which is absolutely amazing. Hundreds of them have sold, but that reorder, we only managed 53. That is because what is in the market right now is actually either owned by collectors or connoisseurs, no more is actually coming from the ground that we know of anyway. No more. So it's people that are, um, that are you know, gemstone buyers for the future, let's put it that way. I've got how many of them left? 
25 of them within the vault. Lynn and JP, Christine Dorset, Olwyn, London, Janice, Northamptonshire, Charmaine, Julie, uh, Mary, Sue. I've got 20 left. Make sure you check them out. Bristol's multi bought. That's savvy. Susan in Lancashire, Sue in Surrey, Doris, hello to you. Jackie in Essex, Penelope, Elizabeth, uh, well done to you. Uh, Lynn, Claire, Lucy. We had lots of new uh, customers joining in in the last hour. Oh, on the first time. Well, that's the the course of the day. It's as simple as this, jewelry makers. If you're watching for the very first time, you're getting a genuine gemstone and certainly a very rare one. The mine is rumoured to be closed um, or put privately purchased, so that means we're not going to get it anyway. Um, anyway, uh, you can dial this free phone telephone number that's at the bottom of the screen, speak to our UK-based contact centre, and within a couple of minutes, this will be on its way. Every single purchase comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee, no questions asked. Not that I think for one second this will be sent back to us. Um, if you're with us on the web, you have to check out that basket. If you don't, and it'll be allocated on a first-come, first-served basis. You still only pay that one postage and packaging. There are just 15 of these left. That's a full 360 strand. I mean, that is, look, if I wrap it around my wrist, you, I, we would recommend restranding this, by the way. I won't stretch it, but that one, I could probably get four full mm. tennis bracelets out of this. I would make a tree of life. I'd make um, a nice, oh. uh, I'd probably do a, what I'd say, a deluxe <laughs> tree of life, yeah. you know, so I would, um, it wouldn't just, it wouldn't be a basic one. It would have woven frame, you know, really sort of um, take it a level up. Wow. That would be amazing, Laura. There are 12 of you with it in your baskets. If this manages to make another auction, which I doubt highly, because I think this is going to be an on-screen sellout, um, there's going to be ones or twos of them available. Ones or twos for 102 carats of natural chrome dioxide. One thing I should have mentioned, and I apologise for this, is get your certificate of authenticity. If you've hung up the phone and you do want to do that, then speak to our contact centre. It's an additional 25 pence. The reason why I say that is it will say that most important word in black and white, chrome, which indicates Russian dioxide. Um, and it will say country of origin, Russian as well. That takes the price tag to a different level. Single figure quantities. So the fact the fact that we only have got a couple of collectors on the web with it still left in the basket, uh, their baskets, that speaks volumes because you recognise, um, yeah, you recognise you know, the fact that you can't hesitate. Well, because there are a lot of collectors watching right now, um, the next, well, the remainder of the show, truthfully, is, is an absolute collector's dream. We've got sterling silver, we've got those beautiful sapphires, we've got zircon still to bring, you've got more amazing pearls, we've got inspiration from this gorgeous lady, um, we've got oh, more tourmaline, wow. so here it is, that gemstone that passed through a rainbow and absorbed all of those lovely colours, look at this, ah. Oh. And you said you wanted a briolette wrap. Mm -hmm. Well, that's what you would do with these gorgeous cuts. I, I will show um, how to do that at some point. Okay. Yeah. No. Definitely getting that. So you can do it with the you could do it with the tourmaline as well, couldn't you? Yeah. Definitely. Wow. 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 Forty-two carats. I'm just going to pop this down for one second. I want to take this off. So good luck and well done to those of you that managed to get hold of that. Absolutely beautiful. Right now, though, let's go back to your tourmaline. So, yeah. Literally, Google search. Price per carat for quality, and I'm not not just the, the worst. The, don't want to say the worst quality. Yeah, not the best quality. Um, it's still four hundred pounds per carat. You have got beautiful clarity. It's Nigerian. Oh, and I just pulled the tassel off. Oh, that cute tassel. Um, yeah, it's Nigerian, and look at these lovely colours. Oh. Again, can I just say, would you all agree that's rubellite? Would you all agree that you've got chrome in here as well? Another one of the rare ones. Chrome is that really lovely dark olive green. Would we all agree that these are sort of you know, pushing towards your swimming pool colours? And you've got some really lovely greens, yellows, golden tones, all completely natural. Right, we're not holding back now, jewelry makers. We're going to go straight down to it because I do want to squeeze a lot of products in this hour if we can. Lots of many, many high-end gemstones, collector's dreams, as Sheridan said. How about a 60% price reduction? We can't physically buy this product for what is on your screens right now. 
and bring it back. We can't do it. We can't. We can't buy it, broadcast it, transport it, at, at anywhere near what's on your screens right now. So that is ultimate clearance. I mean, every business. And can I just mention as well? Every business needs clearance. Every single business. There's nothing to worry about. Jewelry maker is in a very, very good place right now. Um, but we'll do clearance um, every so often because there are certain opportunities where they might be. I don't know. They might have been in the vault for a period of time unjustifiably like the pink tourmaline you had a few moments ago there might be some um there might be some strands that uh, we've got ones and twos of, for example. You know, we, we mentioned we mentioned with that pink tourmaline. I've never even seen that strand. So you might have a presenter that you know isn't as passionate about certain gemstones as others, and vice versa. So yeah, yeah, but that's why that's why these kind of things happen. Moving on to oh. Wow. Look at this wire that we've got coming up, silver wire coming up. Oh my goodness. Well, look at these. These are genuine tourmalines and they are, oh my goodness, you've got a chrome tourmaline in there. Look at that one. You've got a beautiful cognac tourmaline and you've got your lovely pinks. So we guarantee the carrot weight, 10 carats. This, this this is coming up later on. We've got a big clearance deal on your silver wire. So that's averaging two carats per tourmaline. Even if you bought these, did nothing to them and sold them on, you're going to make profit. You actually are. That's ridiculous. Because wow. you would pay that for any one of these. Any one of these. Time is of the essence and we've got a lot to squeeze in. So, oh my goodness, this is so low. So, so look at that. Can you see it on there? Look at the quality of that. That just in a, in a prong set ring. Yeah. I mean, you can do, um, we've got settings, haven't we, for that sort of size. Yeah. Or we've had Tuesday them before. as well. Tune in Tuesday. Oh yeah. Prong setting would be amazing. Oh, oh beautiful. Tune in on Tuesday for your prong setting day. Yeah. Ring mounts as well, you know, the ones, mm. the calibrated ring mounts. We're going to be bringing you more of those at some point. These would be, I'd be all over these as a collector, really. Not just as a jewellery maker, but as a collector. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Okay, moving on. Let's do, are we doing the wire? <clears throat> our wire, Sheridan's just saying, to be honest, it's always set at a clearance price. I agree with that. Um, and our wire, silver wire is very workable, isn't it? Oh, definitely, yes. It's the most, because again, it's great, um, it's very easy to work with, but also being stone and silver, um, if you were to mark it, because you know, sometimes we slip with our pliers and yep. you can take a sort of a little mark on the wire. You can just polish it out when it's stone and silver. It doesn't mark, you know, and also you can oxidize it, you can heat it. Um, there's so much you can do. So we've got the finer gauge wire that's coming your way. Yeah, lovely, soft, malleable wire. Again, if you were watching this morning with Jan, she used a lot of the high end pearls too. Yes. Lovely. Um, any of Laura's fabulous creations? What? That's ah. 7.8 grams of solid 925 sterling silver. I say solid, but it's still beautifully fluid. You can create all of your lovely spirals and all of your fabulous creations. Look, I can do it literally with my with my hands. We're at 12.95. And we've had so much, um, so many gemstones that I would be getting this oh, for. Have to have sterling so you, silver. You know, yeah. you've got these beautiful pearls that I'm working with. You've got this lovely um, pink tourmaline. There's so much that you would want this sterling silver for. How about we take it lower? It's clearance. We've got loads to squeeze in. You have to. We we have to be quite quick off the mark with this one though. Seven point eight grams of nine two five sterling silver. You've got a minute to win it at this price tag though. I mean, that is crazy. I, speak to any of our wire workers, speak to any of mm. our silversmiths, wow. and they would all absolutely agree. Um, we had the conversation earlier on about the fact that our wire, we do ask our wire workers like yourself, mm -hmm. Laura, um, you know, to have a little go of, of working with wire and tell us, to, to, to actually tell us if, it is, if, it's, if it's workable, because you don't yeah. want wire that's so hard that you can't actually sort of manipulate no. it. I mean, can I use that? Yeah, so that's a sterling silk. That is one mil. I mean, I, I, I've just um, sort of dabbling about with soldering a little bit. I've um, 
been working with Hayley, actually. Yeah. She's, um, I've gone to one of her workshops. It's brilliant. Um, and that is one mil wire that's been hammered, soldered together, and it's just, uh, um, you know, and it's, it's a, a solid, solid, sterling, silver solid ring. sterling silver ring. Yeah. That you've made out of this exact wire. Yeah. Wow. And it, well, I, I doubt you imagined that you'd be able to get. No. I mean, lots of rings you'd be able to get out of this. Yeah. Of this one meter long length. Wow. Well, well done. Yeah. You know a deal or two, don't you? There's about 25 left of those at that price tag. So congratulations. Um, okay, moving on. Pardon? Let's do the point four. Yeah, lovely. Oh, that's so yes, why that's... do... Point two five, I beg your pardon. Oh, okay. So with your tourmaline... Yeah, with your tourmaline, it's great for your diamonds. Lovely for diamonds. Because, you know, your diamonds are the ones that are the most um, smaller... They have the smallest sort of drill holes. Um, and so a point two five, you can guarantee we'll go through that. Laura, what three pounds seventy five? You know the wrap loop. You can use this. Mm -hmm. I I can't even look right now. But Sheraton says you've got a minute to win it. I can't even look. That's it. That was already a clearance price for me. Three pounds seventy five was already a clearance. How many have we got within the vault? Wow. See, for me, I love point two five. It's my favourite. And and for the um. DVD that we're doing today, we were using <clears throat> 25 wire actually. Oh, 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 tell us more about this DVD. Well, I don't know if I'm allowed to say what it's going to be. Okay. Um, but go on, go on. So, we're going to be doing some unicorns. <gasps> some little. Heard it here first. <clears throat> so, um, 0.25 is definitely something that I, I use for that because I love using 0.25 and 0.8. That is my favourite wire combination. Oh, yeah, with the unicorn gemstone, absolutely. That is tourmaline. So, look, just to show you that this would be perfect for your briolette wraps that mm -hmm. Laura is going to demo. Um, but, look, you go through all of your sort of gems of distinction um, yeah. um, gemstones, really, like your diamonds, your sapphires, your, your microfaceted. You use your point, uh, your point two five quite a lot there. Um, yeah, we had 51, so you have to check out if you want to guarantee those. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, okay, so pre-orders on the Swarovski chain. Yeah, going crazy. So if you want to, if you want to, do you have a length of it there? Of what? The Swarovski chain. I did. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> pow, 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 pow. Look at that fire, Swarovski beauty. I know, I know, I know. Adam, Adam says, call the fire brigade, because. <laughs> Because this Swarovski is hot. <coughs> I couldn't even get that out. I had a tickle in my throat halfway through and said, stop with the corniness, Al. <laughs> <coughs> Look at that. So coming up in the 9 o'clock hour, but you can pre-order it right now, and it is coming at your clearance. Right, speed auctions, okay? Are we ready? Start from the beginning. Well, that's a good place to start. Well, nine's not the beginning. Eight, okay. Jump rings. Speed auctions. Go, go, go. Look at how many you're getting here. I was going to say these are sterling silver as well, aren't they? So rose gold plated sterling silver jump rings. So these are kind of like gold dust. Um, here we go. They're nine millimetres. You get a hundred of them and you've got 19 grams of precious metal. I mean, that is... Talking about stretchy bracelets, pop your elastic through the centre, oh, make yeah. a full stretchy bracelet. You might need a couple of packs to make the full Sweetie style bracelet. How beautiful would that be? Um, with all the pearls that we've brought you so far, I mean, that's a big gram weight and you get 100 pieces. Jump 19 grams. I had a feeling you were going to do that. I just had a feeling wow. that you were going to do like a pound a gram. That's not I think it was Haley that actually said to me, if you see sterling silver, um, you know, in and around sort of two pounds, three pound per gram, then that's a that's that's a good price. That is a that's a good price. You've got a pound per gram here <laughs> um, for beautiful rose gold plated sterling silver. They're the large jump rings as well. Mm -hmm. um, so these will be nine millimeter internal diameter, won't they? 
nine millimeter. So that's a big jump ring, <clears throat> a big jump ring that you, there are set, they're essentials. And the fact that there's loads of you there checking out instantaneously tells me that that really is an ultimate clearance prize. Well done, everybody. Um, told you this evening was going to be, uh, was going to be worthwhile. Told you you want to watch that program back on record. Told you so. Um, okay, okay. Tom's there. Tom, I wonder if we see him in the crowd. Somebody's seen him. Is he wearing sequins? <laughs> Is he wearing sequins? Um, I know I was naughty, but change channel. It's all right, Karen, we'll let you off. Um, I think I saw Tom <laughs> going to send a picture. Yes, please, oh, please send us a picture, yeah. Karen, so we can just tease him. <laughs> tease him. Te Not that there is absolutely anything wrong with him going to Strictly, but he was a little bit sort of... Have you got it? He was kind of badgered into going to this. So anyway, speed auction. Sorry, Sheridan. Um, here you go, your head pins. These are the super long head pins. We need to see that screenshot. Thank you, Karen. Um, he's been there all day. All day since five o'clock in the morning. It is we tough. To show this. me, show me, show me. I need to see this. 5.95. It is Tom you saw in the background. And his girlfriend, yeah. We can, we'll be able to tell. He'll be the really tall one <laughs> that's blocking. And the person, the person behind him is oh, like, oh, yeah, you can imagine, no. can't you? That person's been there from half past five, and then Tom sits down in front of you. You're like, oh, I gotta look at the back <laughs> of his head all day. Well done, well done. <laughs> can you imagine? Can you imagine? You sit down, and there's a six foot five man sits and plonks himself in front of you. <laughs> like, oh, I'm not going to see any tangos and all of that. <laughs> <laughs> I love the Paso Doble. Paso Doble. Here we go. These are lovely. So perfect for your Christ uh, Christmas makes. <coughs> Excuse me. You've got a really lovely enamel in the centre there. And that is actually double-sided. I don't know if I can flip it over. There you go. Yeah, enamel on both sides. You can separate those if you wanted to. <laughs> Use it as a charm. Use it as a pendant. Perfect pair of earrings. I'm going to show you the should-be price. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm just going to sip my coffee. But show you the should-be price. And then we're going to take it to your clearance. Christmas is round the corner, believe me. Laura, mm. don't look at me like that. It's happening. And Christmas stuff, if you go to, if you if you wait until the high street is, you know, bring you know, marketing all their Christmas goodies, you're, you you might as well just do this, Laura. So if I was gonna go down a different road of <laughs> of um I'm slow. avoiding Christmas, the other thing is that there's um there's a sequel coming out, a sequel film coming out yeah. later this year. Yeah. These, yeah. Yeah, there is. Oh. When I was going to love that. Yeah. When is it coming out? I'm not sure, November, I think. But, November. again, so, you know, certain um, cold Disney film. Um, so, right, know, you're, you're selling this to, to yourself now. I'm, I'm just rubbish. Can't, you can't let it go, I can't can let you? it go, no. That's all right. That's all right. <laughs> but, again, this would be a lovely sort of gift uh, on that kind of theme as well. Hello to you, Channel Isles, Karen Warwickshire. Do you want to build a snowman or ride our bikes around a hall? <laughs> I like it when she goes to the key hall. <laughs> I'll be honest, we saw that one in the cinema and it was one of those who came out and it was a feel-good film. Yeah, absolutely. Willow loves it. Right, moving on. One number. Eleven. Oh, so we've gone from Frozen... To Peter Pan. This is a really beautiful Tinkerbell. And she is in that perfect fairy stance, you know, where it looks like she's blowing her fairy dust. That's a lot of sterling silver. 
Well done, Karen. Yeah, I would be all... Because that is a beautiful gift. Mm. In fact, I think I bought this pendant or something similar at last Christmas um, and gave it to my sister-in-law because she loves all things Disney. All things Disney. So I popped that luxury on a sterling silver chain. I think she still wears it. Every, you know, I think she's one of those pieces that she doesn't really take off. Seven ninety five. Again, look at the gram weight. There's almost two grams of sterling silver. The 925 stamp is on the reverse. Sorry, little fairy. Let me just look in there. <laughs> Sorry, but... <clears throat> There you go. There you go. Bless her. Um, love that. Grab it whilst you can. Move it on. 22-22. Flutterbys. Flutterbys. Well, that's a good film as well. I know that's not what you meant. I meant. I know you meant The Lost Boys in Peter Pan. But Lost Boys is a good film too, isn't it? Mm. Here you go. Um, did anybody... Sheridan's talking about Stranger mm. Things and apparently it's just finished. Did every, anybody watch that? Because I haven't. So I've got... We watched, My husband and I watched the first series mm. and then we got halfway through the second and then we sort of stopped watching it and then I, I, I can't watch it without him and then he, he sort of said, oh... It's not really my thing. Watch one and a half series of it, mind. And then it's not really my thing. You can watch the rest of it on your own if you want. So uh, <laughs> I'm now going well. to find now I'm going to find time to sit down and watch the rest of it by myself. On your own, that's yeah, it. Because have you been watching Captor? The Captor, that's really good. It's a little bit. It's a little bit. Um, Is that the one with um, what's his face? I can't remember. From the office in I can't remember. Martin Freeman. I don't know. Good. Don't think so. Don't think so. No, it's not him. No, no. Seven ninety five clearance price for all of these lovely butterflies. Oh gosh, I'm trying to think. What, what's what's the what's the copper film that's just finished? Um, Line of Duty. It's a little bit like that. Um, Line of Duty is amazing. We've My favourite series. That one. Serious clearance price, jewelry makers. You've got those two little apertures for you to pop your head pins on there. You, um, Sheridan's just making a little suggestion. You make your tree of life out of that chrome mm. dioxide, and you can pop a little flutter by on that there. That would be really sweet, wouldn't it? That would be beautiful. And it'd be easy to do as well because of the connectors on it. So you could stitch it into the tree. That'd be beautiful. You know, we had earlier, you know we had earlier on that lovely findings pack? A really lovely finding pack with the Swarovski. Just pop one of those. Oh, sorry, Cubic Sconia. Pop one of those through the centre just to add that little bit of bling as well. And definitely with your tourmaline because you think butterflies, you think colours, don't you? You think colours. So definitely alongside all of your tourmaline that you've had today. Um, okay, moving on. Oh, this is perfectly vintage. I want to hold up to the neckline. Oh. Imagine that in a choker. With a little bit of lace. I think that would look lovely with this chain as well. Oh, that's a bit lush, isn't it? What are the pearls? That's 925 sterling wow, silver. That's a lot. And look at the size wow. of it. And look at all the connecting points on there as well. So this is its previous closing price, Joe Meg. All those, that lovely gallery to allow all the light behind the cubic zirconia. That's its previous closing price. I mean, look, that's a big... Mm -hmm. Big piece, and that's an amazing price tag with a lovely round, brilliant cut in the center. There again, this is all about making lots of lovely jewelry maker friends. We're not making a single bean on this price tag, <clears throat> in fact, we're losing money as a member of staff. If you're watching right now, I would recommend you dial through right now because you cannot get it at this price tag. And we do get perks, don't we? Well, yeah. Of course, of course, of course. That's wow. way below. I was not expecting that. That's like half. Um, you were thinking about the confession, uh, yeah. Laura, with Martin Freeman. I mean, I haven't seen that either, but I've seen it advertised and I knew it. It's it's a it's, cap it looks catcher, quite cap interesting. Catcher. But yeah, thank you. That's exactly what I'm thinking of. Do watch it, though, if you like Line of Duty. Um, okay, let's do... Which one? Oh, 25. This is very cool. You can wear this multiple ways. So here we go. I'm going to start with this way just because that's how I lifted it out. Um, so it looks like a nice little bar, doesn't it, of sterling silver. Um, inside Aww. there you've got your lovely cubic sconius. But look, look, look. It's really clever because you can actually wear it like this. Actually is a pendant. If I hold up my tweezers. So you can wear it like that. But it's also magnetic, so bear with me. So if you wear a pacemaker, then obviously don't wear it, one of these. But you can also wear it like... This is so clever. 
that. Oh. It's a really beautiful four-leaf clover. We've got a limited quantity of them. You've got the two little loops either side. This would be lovely with the Ostrowski chain that's coming up in the 9 yeah. o'clock hour. And the pearls as well, the, the near-round pearls. These ones. What are you doing with those near-rounds? I'm thinking... I'm getting distracted by all this pretty stuff. Sorry, yeah, to be honest, I've that's been, my fault. Yeah, I've just I've made a few earrings and a, a few rings and stuff. But um, imagine that, and then again, you would you you could adjust. Bear in mind, it's cut. It's open. Oh, okay, sorry. That's no, right. That's right there. That end. Here we go. So if you can imagine that as a full necklace, and then that, and then what that would do is um, it would adjust, obviously, the length of the necklace, however you wear it. That would be beautiful. So you could almost drop it down an inch yeah. or so. Nine pounds ninety. Yeah, lovely alongside those pearls. Any of the pearls that we've brought you today, to be mm. truthful. And you've got that lovely little bit of luck in in, in sort of almost like a four leaf uh, clover design. They are hearts, technically speaking. But I look at that and see a four leaf oh, clover. Definitely. Do. Moving on. Um, I have pearls on the tea bar. Oh, I've got some ivory pearls. I've got some multicolored pearls. The multicolored ones. Here we go. Oh, lovely. Um, and these are actually I'm going to show it up the oh, next time. Oh, that's cool. Earlier. Yeah, look, they've done the work for you here. So six by seven millimeters, but look how they've placed them. So you've got your apricot on either side, and then you've got those lovely, uh, like a dusky lavender color and then it goes up to sort of another sort of dusky pink tone too 38 centimeter strands you know that on a vintage weekend you're going to get the best possible deals and oodles of inspiration our graphics are on the go slow probably melted the phone lines that's why should be 24.95 um, which is amazing, considering that these are natural pearls. Now, if you if you spoke to Fleur, who, um, bless her heart, I hope she feels better soon. Yeah. She did look poorly, didn't she? Yeah, earlier on. Um, Anyway, if, if you spoke to Fleur, if you speak to her about multicolored pearls, she will always say, try and multi-buy if you can, especially if you are looking to make multiple pieces of jewellery, because it's very hard to colour match pearls. Because yeah. obviously they come from different locations, different mollusks. So um, if you are thinking, um, if you are thinking about a sweet, this is about 50, what do you say? About 54 pearls actually on this one strand. So um, that's working out at 46 pence per pearl for a genuine natural pearl. But we are going to go lower. Because it's your clearance and it's the best deal ever. Of course it is. Of course it is. It's our pocket rocket, Sheridan. Nineteen ninety-five. I haven't called you that this evening, have I? Do you know the Viscount of Liam's, the Viscount of Prince of Prince of Plummets, the Plummet Prince, <laughs> <laughs> um, the Prince of Plummets, um, and Sheridan is our is, is is the JM Pocket Rocket. And then there's Wayne, who's priced Bashasaurus. <laughs> you know, they've all got their names, haven't they? They've all got their names. Doesn't um, Liam call himself the bad boy of, shop of television? Liam. Yeah, Liam, yeah, yeah. And I said he's like James Dean, which he quite <laughs> liked that. He quite liked that. Um, moving on to... <laughs> Adam says he's just known as <laughs> sexy, Adam. <laughs> you do get a lot of messages, Adam. You do get, a, there was a lot of love for your, uh, for your Joey Tribbiani smell the fart <laughs> pose then. There was a lot of love for it as well. <laughs> this is beautiful. I love this. It actually came your way um, uh, during, uh, was it the Sterling Silver event? And they flew out the door. It was a big star buy opportunity. Wasn't that on the Halloween show that we That's did? That's it. Because I've got, I bought That's two. That's it. I saw you buying it yeah. actually. There's a lot of They're sterling silver, isn't it? Are they in your bag right yeah. now? In... They should be. I hope they are. That's a big amount of sterling silver, and it's what we call a slider bracelet. It's got to be our number one product again. I'm sure of it. Proof. There we go. I've Laura's got... just bought it. I've got two of them. There you go. So when we say we buy, we really, really do. <laughs> we spend <laughs> a lot. So basically... Ooh. It slides down. Oh, if I show God. you this way, you've got the two loops that you actually attach your gemstones. So, for example, any of your pearls, your chrome yeah. diopside. That's what I'm going to do with mine. What are you going to put on yours? Pearls. You're going to put some pearls? Yeah, lovely. Look. 
Yes. How many? I'm thinking one, two, three. I'm being really spoiled right now. Maybe that. Oh, lovely. So some pearls and a bit of bling in between. Gonna be mine. Twenty-six ninety-five. But. Well, it was scheduled in a clearance show. What? I don't know why it was scheduled in a clearance show. Can I just say, Laura, you might want to close your eyes right now. I don't know why. Listen, I don't know why it was even included. This is, might have been a mistake. I don't <laughs> think this is meant to be in a clearance. I'm I don't gonna make think this it's meant me to... now. Do it, do it, do I'm it. I'm going to do it. I don't think this is meant to be. Don't look at the screens right now, I'm not now, looking Laura. at the screen. I'm distracting myself. So that that is... It's got to be a mistake, right? I'd wear that as a necklace and I would actually take some gemstones, maybe a chrome down. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. So, imagine this as a necklace. It's, it's kind of adjustable because you've got the flexibility in your slider. Yeah. But imagine that as a necklace. That looks really cool, and I'm looking at it with the pearls. You've done exactly the same with pearls. Yeah, that... So it's kind of like a little bit, ooh, a little bit. Yeah. Tip, a bit... Oh, I'm torn now. I bought two, and I bought one to give as a gift to a friend of mine, but I'm actually thinking now. Keep it yourself. <laughs> I might make a necklace and a bracelet yeah. for myself. Do it. Yeah. Do it. Or get some more at this price tag. Yeah. I'm like, oh. 14 95 I don't believe this should have been actually scheduled during our clearance, to be truthful. I think that actually was a bit of a mistake. Laura, yeah, you're probably better off dialing right now. That's I think what... I am, aren't I? Yeah, you are. No, you definitely are. <sighs> so, again, members of staff, you might want to get that now. Um, okay, moving on. Um, what number? Oh. Oh, these are pretty. Oh, these are lovely. Oh, I might have to get some of these. They've actually got a hidden loop, too. So you get how many pairs? Three pairs with the butterfly oh, back. Oh, they're cute. The problem with what? I couldn't work at Jam. I'd have no wages left. I, well, honestly. We don't have any. It's honestly, literally like they pay you with gemstones, effectively, well, because... But, yeah. I mean, I do, I do a lot of, I, I do overtime to feed my JM. The thing is, you and I are not good together either, no, are we? No, we're not great we, together. We would be a nightmare do, if we ever went we out do, shopping we together. We do spend quite a lot as a, as, as a yeah, duo, don't we? it's not good. These are lovely. So you've got a gorgeous Asian-inspired flower with a hidden loop underneath. I'm just showing you. Look. A lovely pearl, yeah, mm -hmm. a pop a pearl on the bottom. Look how pretty these are. Shall I, shall I pop a pearl? Oh, a pink tourmaline. Please put a pink tourmaline on here. Please, please, please. please I can, please. but what I'm going to do whilst I do that is get you to put a pearl on because you're going to do a wrap loop. In That's not even your price. You've got three pairs of earrings. Fair. How many do we have of these? There's only 50 of you them available. Do a wrap, um, Am I doing it now? I don't know, are you? If you want to. No, no, no. no. Do the loop bit first. Oh. Do it to a shopping Are you ready? Hook. Are you ready, folks? Do to, the oh, gosh. Do the wrap loop. Never been at that under oh, wow, 10 price tag pairs. for three pairs of beautiful, beautiful earrings. Right, relax, 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 relax. Right, so just do the wrap loop because you can always attach it with a jump ring. Okay. Okay, so I'll tell you what. I'll do the, um, the pink tourmaline. Shall I quickly briolette wrap whilst you're, um, while you're doing that, I can show you the briolette wrap, okay? Yeah, because this is really because bad Because then one. we'll take the pressure off of you and uh, the concentration face. Oh, look, it's gone it's... back to my really shocking ones. No, that's it. Oh. You see? Breathe and <laughs> relax. Now you've got to cut it as well. It's all wonky woo again. Is it though? Is okay, it Okay, give it a snip. Does it look like I'm really tense? Oh, now be really careful when you cut it, because just... Yeah. Half the stock has gone of these. I can't even cut it up, Clint. It's because you're panicking, and you're trying... <laughs> it's really bad! <laughs> you're like, don't cut it! You were panicking. 
Hang on. Well, it's I not. It's really. I, I will practice though, Laura. I promise I will Hang practice. On, let's have a little look then. I mean, to be fair, it's on TV. Um, hi, Janice. L, you need to take some mm -hmm. wire, a bead, and play. Get used to the wire. Try things. And don't try to make a finish, please. Play. I think that's a, that's a good idea. Yeah. To be honest, I, if I'd have had some 0.6 wire, because I think 0.6 is the ideal gauge for you to practice with, I would have let you use that, but we don't have any. Let's have a look. It's all wonky. How is it wonky? Look, my wire's not very neat. Right. There you go. Yeah, that's really bad. That's brilliant. That's nice. What are you talking about? I'm going to let you look. put a wrap loop on it. And then all you do... Is just tuck, the, crunch the end, tidy it up with your pliers. Look. Yeah. Look at that. That's good. Just the tone Perfect. of your voice tells me that. It's. Oh, it's. <laughs> Maybe we'll just attach. The I will bank. try. I will try. I'll let you put some on those. Um. Okay. I love these. Never well, seen cool. these before. Ooh. Very, very, very Tiffany's, aren't they? So you get the three of them. Gorgeous. Alexandra collection, that's where it's from. Look at that. That's cool, isn't it? I would just want them on a, on a pair of earrings. Rose gold plated, sterling silver. That's, that's just over five pounds each. They're a big, if I put my hand behind. That's a really big, beautiful pendant. So, That's £3.32 each. Wow. And that's a lot of um, silver there, isn't it? You know, I'd, I'd even... Yeah, straight maybe just chain. Pop it... Maybe with a pearl in the middle. Yeah. Something like that. I'd pop it alongside... Can I borrow this beautiful rose? Oh. You know, it works with that. With, oh, that's gorgeous, Laura. Um, I'd, can I... Just, you want me to bring it back? I know. I know, she's amazing, isn't she? <laughs> um, I, can, I, can you show... Can, have you got a strand of pearls? Oh, yeah, yeah this one. Okay. Oh, that's pretty. Look how lovely this is. And it's going with absolutely everything. Just literally pop one. One on a jump ring in between your pearls. Oh, my Love goodness. That. My goodness, my goodness. Hello, Candy. Hello to you, Melissa. Hello to you, Moira. Hello to you, Essex. Hello to you, Debbie. Awesome. Gosh, where's that hour gone? It's absolutely flown by, hasn't it, jewelry makers? Mm. Um, in the next hour, we have Anderson, Rainbow Moonstone, Blue Lace Agate, Cognac Zircon. Hang on. What's this? You're not getting two, though, are you? You get both strands of sapphire in the next hour. I mean, look at that. And if you love your chrome, well, the remaining strands that we actually have currently within the vault are also coming your way in the next hour. Hello, Rihanna. Just tuned in. And OMG, you both look lovely today. I'll oh, bless you. Uh, please, can I ask um, if you have seed beads tonight? Mm, I don't... Tomorrow night we definitely have Rihanna. Um, we've got some eight O's in the next hour. And, uh, uh, then it's and then we've got spaces. So we have got some, but don't go anywhere, Rihanna, because we have actually got loads of really beautiful gemstones, and we've got this gorgeous one, everyone. So um, we shall return. Um, yeah, don't forget we're mastering our we're mastering our Jamaican pose, and we're going to roll out on a Jamaican pose. Okay. okay. So you just have to basically stare at something, anything. Ready? Oh, 
I'm going to put my very poshest voice on to tell you to join us this weekend for our fabulous vintage event. We have 50 brand new pearl products that you are going to be mesmerized by. Some of your favorite guest designers included in that is Fleur, Alison, Jan and more. Pearl deal of the days on both Saturday and Sunday. There's a gorgeous Russian Amazonite bundle the most tantalizing Murano glass. So do join us here at Jewelry Maker for the Vintage Weekend. strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. designer Hannah Osborne here. I'd love you to join me on this Sunday mid-show for the return of the most amazing Murano glass beads. I've got some of my favourite colours coming back and I've got four kits with matching seed beads to go with all of them. So join me on Sunday the 22nd for the mid-show as part of the Vintage Weekend. Are you new to Jewellery Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewellery making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Our brand new Get Started with Jewelry Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewelry making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewelry designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash get started with JM where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewelry making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewelry making journey. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. If you'd like more information on up and coming shows, you can view the program guide on our website. Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? 
You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. I was eating the chocolate biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> and Adam's still doing his smell the fart acting. It's quite scary. <laughs> <laughs> but he goes cross-eyed whilst he does it. So you, you, you'll always know you look like, what, um, if, if that's actually what Adam is doing because he goes cross-eyed. <laughs> Don't you think he reminds you a bit of the, um, the prince out of Shrek 2? <laughs> when you do that face. <laughs> um, I, can't, I can't picture the shrimp. I can't. Oh, the prince, the like with the blonde I hair. I said I can't picture the shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> you know, time for else, oh, Right then. Um, we're going to start with the Swarovski this hour. <laughs> So gimme, gimme, gimme that gorgeous chain. Now, you will get an entire 50 centimetre length, but Laura, well, she's been let loose with it, frankly. That's a bracelet length. I'm going to make a bracelet. Aha. Uh -huh. So look, full tennis bracelet out of your gorgeous Roski. The earrings that I'm wearing um, are also, you know, suspended. You've got your lovely tourmaline suspended from these. Wait until you see this image. Are you ready? You need to sit down, jewelry makers, because this is literally going to knock you off your feet. Beautiful, genuine Swarovski with rhodium plating. Do you know that rhodium is six times the price of gold? So it's very expensive, and it is, it is actually a genuine... Um, mother nature material so six times the price of gold you use rhodium over your 18 karat gold um, as well to bring that lovely brightness and whiteness um, we are taking this to an amazing clearance deal how many do we have well you're already making confirmations at the price that's on your screens right now and there's lots of you multi-buying too but um, before we even came live this evening, Sheridan actually said to me, "L, this Roski chain is, uh, is is just is just amazing. The price that it's going to is absolutely amazing. And have I got quantity? Please tell me I've got quantity. We've got quantity. However, I don't think they're going to hang around at what you're about to see. Um, the price that you're already confirming at is not where it is actually stopping. And the, and the, the potential of these, though, yeah. because, yes, you can create. I mean, that length there, as you've just mentioned, is going to be a tennis bracelet, isn't it? It is with a pearl in it because... I'm sort of jazzing it up a little bit, but you could go plain. Yeah. You could have it with a pearl. Um, the other thing I could do, actually, and I could maybe demo that because we're doing a little bit of sort of um, random demos, really. We are doing random demos. I could demos. show how to make a ring, a connecting, a connector ring out of that. Because each of those are little connectors, aren't they? Yes. They're little individual connectors that you can separate or keep all together as well. Um, it's busy this evening, jewellery makers, and the reason why, well, you love in the vintage weekend... You're also loving this evening's clearance showcase. It's been an entire four hours, well, three hours so far, um, of clearance, 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 and this hour is not going to be any different. Like, we're going to go straight down to it. <clears throat> straight down to it. I mean, just take a couple of those, if you like, and make an opera-length pair of earrings. Three you've got in each ear. I've got three in each ear. Mm -hmm. 11.95. Look how beautiful. I love this. It's so elegant. And again, you don't have to do anything complicated. I just added some jump rings and... Brilliant, really wrap the um, tourmaline. So I just had an itchy nose <laughs> then, all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Laura. I wasn't pulling facial expressions at you. All of a sudden, I just had a really itchy nose. Um, that's eleven ninety five. For genuine Swarovski. That's, in, that's incredible. So show us this briolette wrap that we've lots of we've had lots right. of messages coming in. It's a very interactive show. 
Okay. Um, the tourmaline that are used in my earrings is at the bottom of your oh, screen right earrings, now. earrings, are they? Oh, did I say that? <laughs> in my earrings. In my earrings. Sorry, just <laughs> totally. Um, you know when you say something and you realise you say it absolutely verbally or, uh -huh. out loud. Um, anyway, so a briolette wrap. Lots mm -hmm. of people are actually having um, an issue with a briolette wrap. What is a briolette wrap and how does it differ from a wrap loop? Um, so briolette, well, it's a bit of both, to be honest. Um, and basically, it's just when you're wrapping a top drilled gemstone, okay. effectively. So when you've got a gemstone... You might need to shimmy a little bit. Yeah. And I'll move the, the tray. Now, if you are brand new, lots of people, are, um, uh, lots of new viewers actually uh, tuning in this evening and lots of you joining us as well. That is a free phone telephone number at the bottom of the screen and it dials through to a UK based contact centre. Um, it's free of charge if you're calling off your landline. You will get this sent to you within a few business, uh, business days um, and that's genuine Swarovski. So it takes just a couple of minutes to set up an account or alternatively, mm -hmm. you, if you check out your baskets, you're guaranteed to success that way as well. You still only pay that one postage and packaging irrespective of the amount of items that you buy so we're briolette wrapping we are i'm just going to switch to copper so that you can see probably a little bit easier what i'm doing okay so just give me two seconds so so this is for demo purposes yeah yeah well i would put copper with yeah pink tourmaline anyway because yeah. i love copper so um i'm just going to find my Right, okay. So I'm using 0.4 wire. So ideally, 0.4 is the wire, the gauge that you would go for. You can use 0.25, mm -hmm. um, but what you need to do is just double up, and I'll explain that in a moment. So you take a length of your 0.4. Now, again, these are very small gemstones. So um, obviously, I don't need a ton of wire, but if I was using maybe a larger size gemstone, I would maybe need a little bit more. Okay, so I'm going to take the wire, just feed it through. Bear with me. And drop that down. So I've probably got, if I said, let's have a quick look, about three inches of wire and I want that on the same on both sides. So bring that up. And I mean, this one's a bit longer, that's fine. I can trim that if I wanted to. Okay. So I'm now going to take these wires and I'm going to pinch them nice and close against the point of the gemstone. So you can see there that that's, actually, can I borrow that black? Um, board, board, please. You may. Thank you. There you go. Can you see that a bit better? Is that better? Yeah. There you go. Okay, so you want that nice and close to the top of the gemstone. That is quite important just because it gives a nicer finish, okay? So, and I'm going to switch. This is where the wrap loop comes back into play. Yeah. Okay, so I like to do the wrap loops like this or the brulette wraps like this because we are only using a point for wire. So by doing it using both the wires, what it does is it gives me an extra strong. <laughs> it gives me um, an extra strong wrap. So I've got two wires effectively as opposed to just one. So it gives me extra strength. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to take my uh, wires and again, I'm just going to do a wrap loop now. So I'm push that wire towards me, reposition the pliers, bring the wire all the way over, reposition the pliers. Then what do we do, Al? Um, I'm not, I wasn't listening. We're Sorry. doing a wrap loop. What do we yeah. do now? You wrap it you up. You go up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I'm using both the wires as if they were one. I'm just bringing that all the way around. Nice and controlled. And then when you're happy with that, I'm just going to cut the wires. Because these are smaller gemstones, I'm not going to come down across the top of the gemstone. But if you've got sort of um, a bigger gemstone, what you can do is I tend to take one of the wires and just cut it and I'll just show you as an example and then the second wire you can, as long as you control it nice and slowly you can bring this to wrap and almost create like a bead cap and as long as you're nice and you can see I'm being really relaxed with this I'm not pulling this wire too tight because otherwise it will skimmy up. skimmy skimmy <laughs> <laughs> Little skimmy. It's, it's a it's a Laura word. Okay. <laughs> I love how you all just accept that. Yeah. yeah okay. okay. Makes yeah. sense. Um, okay. And then once you're sort of ready, <laughs> it's been a long day. <laughs> 
Um, and so what I would then do is take that wire and bring it at an angle across the front of the gemstone because you've got to get rid of that wire. You've got to finish this off. So for me, I might as well make a feature of this. So I'm just going to take that and just wrap it around the very top of that loop there and then just trim that. And that would give you, bear with me a moment, just switch my plate. I just, that's it. So you can see then, so that's obviously giving it a little sort of bead cap. And the way that I've done them in the earrings that Elle is wearing, um, I just stopped at the um, uh, wrap loop stage. And that's how you just do a simple brulette wrap. How are you getting on? Yeah, well, I didn't cut my wire, so I'm just um, wrapping doubles. That's good. So it's, look. It's, it's on a wonk again. That's not on a wonk. <laughs> To be fair, you started off without using, yeah, and all that is, is where you were doing it quick. Okay. Where you were, because you were going, because you were rushing, you weren't, and that will happen because it's, a, and it's a small gemstone. So to be honest with you, you started off with a teeny tiny gemstone. Yeah, yeah. That's already good. I've covered most of it. <laughs> um, oh, look at this. I will practice, I promise. I will that's practice. That's really good. Oh. Uh, if you have any questions uh, for Laura, then we are live here in the studio, so feel free to message us. Do you know what? I forgot we had these. Look at how beautiful this amazing um, blue lace agate connector is. That is 925 sterling silver, and if I just turn it that way, you can see that's a huge amount of precious metal as well. That's our should be, and to be honest, I, I think that's the should be price for this. You don't just get that though, you also get a selection of your lovely blue lace, the queen of agate, your blue lace agate. Um, you also get a selection of these absolutely beautiful cabochons, so I've got marquee shapes, I've got ovals, look at that really lovely elongated pair. Um, you've got wonderful cloud like formations within this gemstone. $33.95 is our should be price, but... Oh my goodness, this is an amazing price for blue lace agate. Wow. How often do we see blue lace agate? It's not that frequently. No, we don't. And it's very, actually, it's very sought after. A lot of the time, um, we get people in the workshops, and the first thing they'll say is, have you got blue lace agate? I bet, because it's such an, it's such an angelic gemstone, isn't it? It's very um, calming, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. It, you just get that wonderful sense of well-being just looking at it, I don't mean, you? That with Lo the connector, beautiful. Lovely. Well, yeah, with your Swarovski chain, yeah, mm. I love that idea. Um, and also alongside one of your kits, because mm. you have got blue lace agate in one of your kits, Twenty-two ninety-five. Does anybody else think that seems an amazing price with that big connector on it? Yeah. So um, I'm going to hold this up to the neckline again. In fact, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm going to get some pearls and I'm going to show you. Imagine this is a full necklace, complete, obviously. Now, that with a lovely clasp. Imagine that as a beautiful blue lace agate and pearl necklace. Pop a clasp at the top there. Oh, I mean, that how is high end. Stunning. Isn't it? Beautiful. There are less than 20 of these available, jewellery makers, grab mm. them whilst you can. Yeah, with that class, that lovely findings class that we had earlier on. I mean, for the cabochons, that seems amazing. Um, you're lapping this up. Hello to you, Siobhan. Hello to you, Jane. Hello to you, Michelle. Hello to you, Kerry. Um, do feel free to text us live. We are still in the studio live. If you're not watching on the repeats, we'd love to hear from you. If you've got any questions for Laura, then feel free. If you've got any questions for anybody, really. Um, yeah, yeah. There's, a, there's, there's quite a few of you watching, grabbing these deals this evening, and I don't blame you one bit one bit well done handful of those left check out if you want to grab those um okie dokie moving on seven mm. sticking with this beautiful blue lace so your botswana agate is named the king of agates and the blue lace is named the queen they do command the highest prices because of their rarity and because of the beauty, the sheer beauty, they're such a pretty stone. Um, so you get, the best way I can describe it is, it was a lovely day today, right? It was really sunny, mm. wasn't it? It was absolutely gorgeous. I got, I stepped into the car, oh poor Adam, doesn't seem daylight today. Um, <laughs> I stepped into the car and it, my, my car actually said it was 30 degrees. I know it wasn't that, but it was probably just because the sun was on my car at that time. It was warm though, right? Lovely blue skies, just the occasional gentle cloud rolling past. That's what I imagine when I actually see, um, when I actually see these. So this is, is, hang on, have I got the right one? Number seven? Yeah. So you get this too? Yeah. 
Stunning, isn't it? Oh my goodness. Oh, it's a pendant. Yes, the other one was the connector. This is the pendant. So that on your pearls. Oh, definitely. Absolutely, definitely. I would pay $34.90 for that gorgeous blue lace. It's a big amount of precious metal. Comes with the actual pendant, so it's just ready and waiting to be suspended from whichever necklace you decide. Um, beautiful. $24.95. And then don't forget these lovely drop tumbles. So you could do your briolette wrap that you've just mastered. You can. Oh, I've actually used them in this pair of earrings, and I've done very, I have done exactly that briolette wrap. I'm not, so I've done uh, that necklace. Laura, I did have my eye on those earrings. They are amazing. So those those earrings there, I mean, surely over the price that's yeah. on your screen. Oh yeah, right most there. definitely. And again, I've only used two of those tumbles in those earrings. Um, they're absolutely beautiful. They're big statement stones, mm. aren't they? Um, now we have got um, a, a few more in terms of quantity. Sheridan is saying so. She is going to do a little bit more on that price tag for you, folks. So for those of you that have already made your confirmation, everybody pays the final low, irrespective of whether you dialed immediately or whether you're dialing through right now. I mean, again, that if you were to see, if you were to find blue lace agate, lots of sentiment, lots of myths and legends attached to um, this beautiful gemstone. There's lots of beliefs in terms of its um, well-being and that and what it brings to you as the actual wearer itself 19.95 you would pay that for the strand or you would pay that for the pendant don't yeah, you think that pendant i mean is absolutely stunning and that is a natural natural gemstone you do get levels of opaqueness and levels of transparency it is like i said that perfect summer's day sky blue that you're looking for with those wonderful um uh, original as well because there's no two that will be the same um formations and patterns across the entire uh, you know every single one of those gemstones hold those phone lines well done we are going faster this out because i want to squeeze everything in okay mm, yes we stick with the blue lace here we go. Oh wow! So I've got. I'm a real fan of a plain rondelle. I so, so most gemstones in my eyes, and I know everybody's different. I actually prefer them non-faceted in that shape. I just think it's really beautiful, mm. especially with something as gentle as blue lace. Um, so I, again, am I missing something? Oh my goodness! Oh wow! So you yeah. get some really lovely charms. But look at these charms. I remember launching these. I do remember launching these. That's sterling silver. Can you see? On either side of your blue lace. So set differently. So one goes kind of horizontally and one goes through the gemstone. Um, oh my goodness, I'm struggling to hold them, but you, you, you get the idea. They go beautifully with your pearls. Old blue eyes. Who do they call old blue eyes? Frank Sinatra. That's it. Sorry. <laughs> old blue eyes, that's it. $29.95. Well, I can tell you the pendants on their own were, if you were to buy both of them originally, they were about that price tag. Hi, Joy. Hi, Laura. What difference between um, a flat nose, what, well, sorry, what's the difference um, between a flat nose plier and a chain nose ones, please? Good question. Okay. So, I don't have <coughs> a pair of flat nose with me for once, which is very, very rare because I always have flat nose pliers with me. <clears throat> but basically, chain nose taper down to a point. Mm -hmm. So these ones taper down. So they're chain the nose. So these are chain nose or snipe pliers. Some people call them um, snipe pliers. Um, but the flat nose are literally a, a rectangle almost, and they're both exactly the same size. Um, and that's the difference. These taper down. The flat nose. The flat nose are the same shape. Yeah. So yeah. Um, you have got that curve. Yeah. No, Good they don't. Question, they don't John. taper down. Yeah. <laughs> Yvonne's got a question for you as well. Uh, hi, Laura. Just bought the pink tourmaline. Oh, Yvonne, you're going to love it. Um, to go with another strand. I want to make a necklace. What would you put in between? Thank you. Um, well, if you look at the way that it's actually stranded, they've got little spacer beads um, already stranded onto it. So it does give you an idea exactly of how you would be able to restrand it if you wanted to. But, I mean, you've got pearls. You've got... Uh, yeah. Oh. That was that was my that was my bad crimping. 
It would just hold those ones and imagine <laughs> alternating the two. Was it Yvonne? Yeah. Yvonne, no, just imagine. Look at that. Pearl, pink tourmaline. Pearl, yeah. pink tourmaline. Oh! That would be beautiful. I mean, you can Ooh. literally... Or you could even just um, coil, very fine coil wire and put that in between Lovely. or some little tubes. Anything that you want. Um... Love that idea. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Wait until you see this moonstone. Can I have that black board back now, please? You may. Um, it comes within... Thank you. It actually comes within the little collector's dish. But if ever you've asked the question, what's the, di what's the difference between a moonstone and a rainbow moonstone? Because you do get some which are called both. A rainbow moonstone, it's fairly obvious, will, show, will, dis will, will display... The full rainbow, not just the bluish adrolescence that we normally get. I'm going to tilt this forward and hope that you can see it. Um, oh, wow. Can you see? Hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm going to pick it up with the tweezers. Hang on a second. I'll, put, I'll tell you what, I'll try on the back of my hand first. That is that rainbow. That's the definition. Can you see it? The full spectrum within the gemstone, and that occurs completely natural it's a perfectly calibrated gemstone so this will work with any of your prong settings this um yeah this is the this is some of the finest quality um that we offer in rainbow moonstone and it is coming your way my goodness at a clearance price over five carats in one solitaire wow i mean wow wow um, wow did i see a promo for or a VT, sorry, for um, gallery wire. Coming up on Tuesday? It probably is on Tuesday, yeah, because we've got uh, a gem setting day. So, yeah, gallery, wire, gallery wire, sterling silver gallery wire. Ooh, yes. Get this, you've got it ready. Because that, that's what I would be adding that to. I mean, of that quality, then it's, I would it's, be... It's, yeah. it's on, I think, all day, because it's on, yeah, yeah, morning... Um, but yeah, we've got because we've got gem setting as well. So I think I think we've got Haley and Gemma, uh, sorry Haley and Claire um, on on Tuesday. So yeah, prong setting, mounting, mm -hmm. all of those things. So this is a calibrated stone. So even if you've got a mount in your um, or you buy a mount, even I know there's some on the horizon. Yeah, just get uh, get hold of this, mm. and all you need to do is coax those prongs down. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful quality. Um, okay, now next star buy. It is this gorgeous gemstone, the oldest gemstone that is on the planet, and I'm talking the splendor that is offered through zircon, a gemstone which is often mistaken for your diamonds or cubic zirconia, and it really shouldn't be because this is actually a genuine gemstone, totally and utterly natural. It's a star buy, and if you want to be astounded, then we're about to. Oh, my love for zircon, it has always been in my top five gemstones. And that's because it's rarer than a diamond, far rarer than a diamond in actual fact. If it was marketed in the same way that diamonds were, it would be, it would, it would be deplete within a year. It offers many of the same colours that diamonds do, um, but you get more dispersion, you get more oomph, for want of a better description, more fire, more brilliance within that very gemstone. Now these are absolutely jam-packed and the briolette technique that you've just seen, uh, Laura Demo, would work perfectly because these are exquisitely faceted um, briolette drops. So this is a strand of natural beauty. Sometimes zircon will, uh, will be treated, heat treated usually, to encourage the beauty, to encourage those hues. Uh, but such is the quality um, we should expect it to be a high uh, high-end price tag but Sheridan has just said to me L I'd love to uh, I'd love us to talk and talk and talk and talk about this gemstone but we're running out of time we've got less than half hour on the show and also this is not your price this is an absolutely astonishing price tag a hundred carats of natural quality Madagascan zircon this price um, yeah I, I've, I've personally brought this to air not that long ago at the price that is actually on your screens however um, we have got sort of an opportunity just for a few collectors 
to get a clearance price. Listen, it happens. It's not just us that do this clearance prices. We do it. I, I, you know, how many, have you ever bought a dress from a retailer and then gone back a week later and it's been reduced? Yeah, it happens. The same applies with your gemstones here as well, folks, because we can't just keep a few of them within the vault. That's preventing us from bringing in new amazing goodies. Marie's just come back from Hong Kong, so you know that she is going to be bringing more gorgeous beauties. Um, we are going to take it so low, so, so, so low for natural cognac zircon. 4.4 billion years of uh, yeah of age. That's insane. That's incredible. We think about amber as being one of the old the oldest gemstones, and it categorically isn't. No, that is a, and there's so much, so much on that strand. I mean, they are packed, aren't they? Because of the way that they're they're um, threaded, they're you always doubled. Yeah, with the amount that you have on there. I, I agree. This is a gems of distinction strand times two. Times two. Mm. What have we just done? Oh, I did not see that price. I was expecting that to be in the 60s. If well, it not... was, 69.95, yeah. and that yeah. was amazing. But we've, I mean, that is such a vintage color as well, isn't it? Absolutely, that is absolutely beautiful. If you've got any of the pearls, your deal of the day pearls would be lovely. Um, the pearls that we've still got, um, that is a crazy price tag, and already the confirmations are being made. I have to say that's one of the purchases of the of, of the day, mm. I think, to be truthful. Zircon is incredibly rare. It's highly, highly dispersive. Um, we know that during a clearance, listen, sometimes we go lower than the price that we actually even bought the gemstones at. But that's because, well, needs must, I suppose. It's one of those that we can't, we can't just sit on stock that even if there is just one or two of them in there, they're too beautiful to do that. We want you to be making jewellery with them. So I'm picturing a really beautiful cluster style pair of earrings maybe like the ones that uh, I'm wearing right now they would be lovely, lovely with them you took the words out of my mouth yeah as meatloaf said <laughs> mr. be while you were with me <laughs> oh they would be beautiful with that with with yeah. tourmaline wouldn't they yeah Pink tourmaline. Be beautiful. The tourmaline was how much? $44.95. Yes, it was. <clears throat> $44.95. The Soroski was $11.95. So let's say $57. Yeah, rounding it off. <clears throat> you could sell these earrings for more that in, than that entire... Mm. Strand and then if you got this strand the cognac zircon you could do zircon a zircon version Oh Just imagine little little briolettes of zircon at mm. the bottom there little clusters. That love be beautiful. It. Love it. Love it. Okay. Hold those phone lines moving on. Oh I have. I was just saying to you that we have like a handful of chrome dioxide within our vault, don't I? Literally. So I think there's single figure quantities. Look at the length of the strand. Oh my goodness. Um, I uh, I picked up both. Yeah, 21 first. Do you want to do 21 first? But we have got the remaining quantity, or well, the few I should say, um, of the strands available to you now in clearance. That makes no sense. Um, I, again, I actually think our schedulers could get could get a dressing down for this. Because <laughs> to, to, to be fair, um, we had this is the only gemstone which has actually commanded an email being sent out to all producers and schedulers saying do not reduce the price of chrome dioxide. That's the only time I've ever known a gemstone actually prompt a, an e email exclusively about um, you know saying that. Um, and yet it, here it is, here it is in clearance, and because it's scheduled, we've got to do it. We have to do it. These are big calibrated sizes anything over half a carat anything over 50 points is rare you've got 72 um and let me count them i'm going to work out the average carat weight on this strand look at that length of strand 38 centimeters i mean normally gems distinction strands about 14 isn't it um okay so let me count them hmm. two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen eighteen twenty 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56. But look at the size of that one. Over a carrot in each one on average. Look at the size of that one. 
I mean, yeah, these are the largest ones, but my goodness. <clears throat> Guest designer Fleur owns chrome dioxide in her own jewellery collection. She bought it as a finished piece of jewellery. And, um, well, I, can, I, I, I know that she paid more than what's on your screens right now. And I know that hers is a trilogy, I believe. It wouldn't be anywhere near the carat weight that's on right now. No disrespect, Fleur. It's an amazing, amazing ring. But I'm just saying this is a hi highlighting a fabulous deal. Um, are you ready? It's going to clearance. Again, I do think some um, some schedulers might be uh, might be in a bit of trouble on Monday morning following the, the, the fact that this is included in this evening's show. Because we can't physically buy it, we find it very, very difficult to buy it at the moment, even more so than things like your Tanzanite, even more so than possibly even your Paraba. Um, it's, it, it's, it's one of those that's always on the radar of our buying team. However, very little of it is about diopside. Yes, you can get that from different locations. Chrome diopside, not so much. So that's working out how much each? 87p. That is, and there's so much. There is so much on that strand. I mean, that's a, a, a long strand. 87p for an wow. average of one carat each. Amazing. It's amazing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Over a carat. Well over a carat in actual fact. Yeah, I'm not surprised that we've got collectors getting involved. Well done. Lisa, Lynn, Joan, Angela, you're all there. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised in the slightest. Okay, let's bring you the next clip. I do love this strand. I'm quite tempted by this strand. There's something about chrome diopside in a faceted wheels. They are beautiful. They just give that amazing intense natural color, but then they give all this gorgeous sparkle across the surface as well. 46 carats, look at that. I mean, that is just finesse in a gemstone. Wow, that's beautiful. And that's all natural beauty. Yeah, use a gold connector. Use that lovely, uh, yeah, thank you. You read my mind again, Laura. So Laura Laura bought this literally on, during the Halloween show, wasn't it? Yeah. And that so was your just, fault. Don't you? I, don't I blame know. you. That's okay. You Get me the me. spinel, Laura. Get me the spinel. Open the basket. Go on. Yeah, but look what you've got now. You've just made yourself a really beautiful bracelet. She's a nightmare. Honestly, I am that person because I am, you know, YOLO. You are only here once and all that. <laughs> you can buy a pair of shoes. A coat, a dress, any time. You see, can't even now you're justifying it. I, well, listen, you can't, <laughs> like... you can't always buy chrome dioxide. This, <laughs> if it's still being mined, and that is a big if, three months of the year this is actually in production. Three months of the year this is actually being unearthed because the extreme weather conditions like, like i said earlier on it's the only gemstone that i've ever known the powers that be actually send an email out saying do not drop the price of chrome dioxide we cannot buy it and this isn't your fault Sheridan. it was literally scheduled so what are you supposed to do take it to the lowest possible price tag that's what so that's working out at less than a pound per carat of chrome dioxide i love the faceted wheels two millimeters in their thickness it's a gemstone that loves to be actually quite shallow faceted because of its dark colour. Um, you're looking at over 120 chrome diopsides on this one strand. Hold those phone lines. Well done, well done, well done. Moving on to... Oh, ooh. Price appraise has been requested. So we've got a customer message in for this. Well, guess what? We actually have this one. This is beautiful. You've got just a level of... A level of transparency. that's about who messaged that have we got anonymous text message okay okay so yeah let me explain so listen before any rumors start congratulations <laughs> to Elle on her pregnancy when are the twins due lovely I'm not pregnant I know where this comes from Do you know initially and I was like hey 
Hey? Um, do you remember we had this conversation and I actually mentioned, was it with Alex? That's right. And he gave me a stone and he said, you be careful because that um, oh. aids fertility. Let's just put it oh, that was way. that that thumb stone? The thumb yeah, stone. Yeah, because I was on with Hannah. She made me touch her. I was like, no. Yeah. And yeah. then I said, and, and then I said something like, oh, don't do that because you watch, I'll end up with twins. And then I said, there's also a 75% chance of me getting pregnant with twins uh -huh. because my mum's a twin and both of Tom's parents are twins and as well. And it skips a generation. It skips a generation. So I'm not pregnant and there's no <laughs> twins. But yeah, that's where that came from. But if you wonder why we went quiet then for a second, I was like, ah, hey? <laughs> I can't wear this dress again. <laughs> <laughs> I just ate bread, okay? <laughs> ah, there we go. Right now, my husband's watching, sweating. Yeah. <laughs> Twins. Um, anyway, back to your Chrysler phrase. Yeah, I, I've just I've remembered now what that came from. So no twins. There are no twins. No baba. No baba. Um, well, I, hope, I don't think so, anyway. <laughs> I don't think so. 92 carats of this beautiful, natural chrysophrase gemstone coming all the way from uh, Australia. You get that gorgeous, like a neon green. Look amazing alongside your pearls. Don't you think I'm going to show you again alongside such pearls like this? Wow. 33.49 um, only. Wow. For a chrysophrase, here's a gemstone you don't see very often. And it, it, it has got a really lovely energy behind it, don't you think? Yeah, Australian chrysophrase. So again, you've got that prestige of it. You're not looking for clarity. It's not like a, uh, it's not like a chrome or a, or a peridot. You're looking for that beautiful semi-glow, semi-transparency glow. Moving on to... Oh, somebody asked for sea beads. So whilst we haven't got many sea beads in this evening show, we will do tomorrow. Um, and here's a few. <clears throat> So these are three millimeters in their size. They're called, uh, they're classed as Atos. I use these a lot, a lot. I actually use them usually at the back of a necklace um, or in between mm. gemstones just to create, you, you know we said about the space tourmaline, out, just to yeah. space it out somewhat. Um, you've got approximately 700 beads in these. Great on memory wire, you know the message we had earlier on on memory wire? They'll breeze on memory wire. All the pearls, yeah, coming up next. We have some really beautiful bracelets um, throughout, throughout the show, which I've shown you. Yeah, really nice little... In fact, our in-house designers use your Mayuki beads quite a lot, um, all these type of beads, for that purpose. For that purpose. Gorgeous. seventeen ninety five for gold-plated spacer beads. You can do your you can do your French beading. You can do all of your peyote stitch, all of your chenille spirals. You can do all of the sea bead techniques, or you can just use them as a spacer. You can use them with your shibori, can't you? But you can yeah. also use them as weaving with your wire. I was going to say with wire. Yeah, so nice that's how wire. I would use them. Yeah. Um, so Sheridan is actually just saying, and I'm just checking something because this clearance price seems low even by Sheridan standards. Um, Oh my goodness, my goodness, my goodness. Yeah, with all of your wire work, I mean all um Yeah and you it, can weave or you can actually add little little punctuations if you like with um with sea beads. Ten pounds for over seven hundred pieces. Ten pounds. And they the go thing, a long way, don't they? Yeah, and the, with the um the size of a drill hole as well, it will go on your heavier gauges of wire. Like your point six is yeah, well on your point eight, I would think. As wow. well. Yeah. So again that helps if you want to add it into your designs. You could again weave it into um your sort of neck designs, anything you want really. Yeah, we sell gold plated spaces in packs of like twenty, don't we? Of packs of twenty, you've got seven hundred in this tube. That's a lot, and that's and it, and you, you surprised at how of, how often and handy they'll come. I can't get my words out. Now. We know what you mean, though, yeah. don't we? How handy? How often you'll use them, and, and how, how handy, handy they will they'll be. become. There you go. Yeah, it's all right. It's it's been a very very long day. That's that's less than how much? Less than one p, one and a half p. Beg your pardon. One and a half p per bead. One and a half p. Sure, even Sheridan's gobsmacked by that price tag. Do you know what? Um, memory wire, because we had the question earlier on, mm. didn't we? 
memory wire if you literally just and all you need to do is kind of pop these in a dish and kind of shove the memory wire and they literally they honestly they jump on they kind of jump on do a little loop at, loop at the end maybe pop some of your pearls on there with shell pearls something like that you've just made a really gorgeous piece of jewelry elastic they work on elastic too Look great. Macrame. You, they work in macrame. Jan uses these where she actually macrame and used the bead on the outside. Yeah. Like, that, that was lovely. Yeah. Perfect. Um, okay, I keep showing these pearls. Keep showing them to you. And they are absolutely gorgeous. So here you are. Oh. Please tell me that, yeah, I was going to say, tell me they're described as near round pills because they most definitely, definitely are. Six and a half to seven and a half millimetres in their size. Full 38 centimetre strand. I've reached for these, I don't know how many, time, how many times, with the zircon, absolutely, with your chrysophrase, with the um, pink tourmaline, yep. all of the above. They're going to look absolutely beautiful, aren't they? Um, so earlier on in the show, at the beginning of the evening show, we actually had the larger size of the high luster. Um, this is, as I said, then back then, you know, when you go down to maybe your six, seven, and eights, that's more class as your princess size pearl, and it sits kind of at this length. Um, just below the nape of the neckline. So use, we've had silver wire earlier on, haven't we? Use some of the silks that we had throughout the course of the day. Uh, again, with one of your precious metal findings, I think, because they are worthy of that. Anything, whenever you see that word, round or luster, um, within a cultured pearl opportunity, you can expect normally for it to be a bit more considered. Not today, because it is clearance, <clears throat> and it is also past of the vintage weekend. This right here is your lowest ever price for this level, this beautiful, beautiful quality. So we were saying about adding it with the pink tourmaline, so I'm just kind of working on a, and this is just putting it onto beading thread. Just to make a little loop or just it was going to be a little section but i just thought i would um, sort of change it up a little bit and that's going to be sort of going on to a, like a nice le neckline piece look at that but and that's just using beading thread so just to show how easy it is to to work with yeah it, it, the beading thread we even had that for you this evening haven't mm, we yeah we've had everything yeah so you've had your class your findings mm. your head pins your jump rings you've had it all gemstones <clears throat> now who did um, okay, one of um, one of our uh, previous colleagues, shall we say, just got married, literally, and she looked lovely, and she had a pearl necklace which was given to her by her dad, about the same size. Was it a full 360 pearl necklace with a with a gold clasp? And it was £180, that pearl necklace. To be honest, I think that's a good price That as is well. actually a good price, a yeah. That was sale, by the way. Yeah. That was a sale price. It is. Yeah, that's an amazing deal but with a gold clasp. So it is that very classic pearl, um, princess pearl, I keep saying it, princess pearl necklace size, isn't it? Because it's not too big. It's not too small. It's something that you could wear out for that, um, for that special occasion. You could wear it to the office. It's perfect for the bridal creation. It's got simplistic, timeless elegance. We're not stopping there. That is your lowest price, jewel makers, that you saw on your screens. But we will go lower because we are coming to the end of this evening's clearance event. Oh, my goodness. And these are no different. Do you know the reality is there is only one pearl um, label, if you like, one pearl brand that owns their own farm. Mickey Moto owns his own pearl farm. So what that tells you, and the reason why I'm mentioning that, is that Chanel, Boodles, Cartier, Van Cleef, um, Argos, yeah, absolutely, Samuels, I mean, I'm, and I'm, I'm talking about the highest of caliber jewelers and even to some of the lowest still go to the same pearl farms. They'll pay the same prices that we do. However, it's the quality of the pearls that will dictate those prices. But because we don't buy just a few, I mean, don't get me wrong, certain ones of the chains of those will actually probably buy a larger quantity as well. But they have a bigger markup, a greater markup than we do here at Jewelry Maker. So granted, you've got to put the class, you've got to put the actual jewelry making into it, but you couldn't even get those at Argus at that price tag, I highly doubt. Um, okay, moving on. Oh, I love this. I can't believe we've got six minutes left on the <laughs> on show. Um, and I, you know when you have to kind of double check? So, am I meant to have the two strands on this T-bar? It's a deluxe duo. Tell me, tell me what you're taking this to. Oh, 
<laughs> Tell me what you're taking it to. You get both. And these are all sapphires. Now, this, another gemstone, much like your tourmaline, that comes in a full rainbow of colours. So you get your lovely pinks, you get colourless, you get gorgeous blues and yellows. And 99% of the world's sapphire will actually be treated. Fine, no problem with that whatsoever, much like your tans might, it's that assumption. How about if I told you that this was natural? These haven't undergone any treatment. And it's something that I think our jewelry maker customers really strive for wow. is that natural beauty. I'd be using this with a sterling silver wire or, you know, you're, you're definitely your precious metals. Um, you get both of them. And that's just art price to be truthful. Wow. I might have to get these. This, this, this is Cambodian natural sapphire. Again, that location is producing some really beautiful gemstones. To get sapphire with clarity, to get sapphire that in one thing, to get the carat weight, to get that quality and intensity of colour saturation, the more saturated, the more valuable the gemstone. And that's why we often influence it to a little bit of heat treatment or fissure filling to improve that saturation. This didn't need any of it. You've got some really lovely sort of golden paparaccia-esque colours. You've got your gorgeous hot pinks. You've got pure sapphire. So the colourless sapphires are completely pure. Um, and that that's why they're almost like diamond-like in their clarity. Then you've got the rarest of colours, um, <clears throat> and the first that was ever discovered actually is these lovely cashmere velvety, uh, velvety blues. So um, I should say Pabodacha are the rarest, but the, the blue is certainly up there still to this day, and that's why it commands some of the highest prices. The price that's on your screen, that for the two of them is absolutely amazing. For that quality, for the natural, um, <coughs> The lateral luxury of these as well. Now, this, yeah, I agree, should not be in a clearance deal. I don't think we should be double um, bundling them either. But... Ten percent off that price tag. Twenty percent off that price tag? Thirty, Adam says. How about 40? Off that, oh my goodness, these, these would be tennis bracelets. Oh wow, beautiful. <clears throat> I've got green sapphire in here as well. Oh, I'm tempted to buy these. And I think they would actually just be, do you know what? I might make two bracelets, use the 0.25 silver wire that we had earlier on, make that gorgeous two double tennis bracelets, one for Lily, my little girl, and one for me. That's absolutely stunning. I'm just... They're so beautiful, aren't they? Wow. And to be able to have it in all those colours. Yeah. I and, mean, wow. And don't get me wrong, I wouldn't be giving it to her now at a tender age of three. It would be something that she would get maybe at a later, at oh, a later yes. stage. Um, do you know what? <laughs> <laughs> Sheridan, Don't buy I've, it. Ne I've never heard Sheridan actually say this before. Um, as a producer, this goes against her, their nature to say this. She said, but you know what? I almost don't want you to buy this at that price tag because she feels like she feels like that that is almost a mistake. I agree. Um, the quality, the actual quality of these is just unbelievable. I mean, look at that clarity. So these are working out at, what, £45? Forty-five pounds per strand for, tr for 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 clarity, for colour, and natural beauty. That's why we say <clears throat> that you should get your certificate of authenticity. Hey, stop selling it, Sheridan <laughs> says. I, I should have took the graphics out. I'm gonna have to say this is your favourite auction of the evening, isn't it? Well, no. Oh, because <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back to Marit. Like, if that is natural, that's gonna get a whole. That's gonna be pulled. Do you think that's a mistake? 15 years, I can tell you, you've probably seen like three natural sapphires. Natural. Natural. 
Yeah. Anyway, that's the way. <laughs> just mm. we we do have natural sapphires, but I, I will agree with you in that si in that price. size at that price. Yeah, no. That's my issue. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm gonna no. have to flag it. I will, but for now, enjoy the moment. Did you mean to leave that? Oh yeah, there was a competition yesterday. I'm sorry. Oh, I was gonna say. Um, okay, you had a competition yesterday, this and it's to win now. this. No. So, ooh, ooh, lovely. So if you were tuning in last night. The winner is, I can't read your, Katie Parker made this, I can't read your writing. I think it, does that say, is, does that say Juliet? Juliet Taylor, you are the winner of this absolutely beautiful, is that, is that an amber? A gorgeous wow. double drilled amber ring, amazing. So you don't need to do anything, my darling. We have your customer number. This will be sent to you. Congratulations, um, huge congratulations. You've received a, you received a lovely, um, a lovely ring there made by Katie Parker. Now, um, uh, we've had a few questions apparently. Hi, Ellen, Laura, um, is this p pink sapphire's paparazzo? Right, uh, do you know what? Again, paparazzo sapphire, like the tourmaline, like the ruby, conversation that we had earlier on it's very much in the eye of the beholder um, it depends what gemologist will actually grade them and what won't some gemologists will say that country of origin makes a difference some gemologists don't if you um, to be truthful with a paprika sapphire you're looking for those sort of golden colors with an element of pink in there as well so I mean when you come to read when you come to actually sort of cut, mm. cut the strand if you can see an element of that gorgeous lotus flower pink then possibly possibly I, I have to be quite cautious in answering that um, I'm amazed and it will be natural true paparazzi sapphire will be natural as well we're running out of time Laura thank you so much and thank you yes. for the wrap loop I'm gonna practice you will you will do it I promise I practice when are you back next Sunday on a late show yes I'm back with you bright and early and in fact if you're watching on the repeats literally you do this I might change <laughs> we'll be in the morning yeah all of us there see you then Love Jewelry Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewelry Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select Continue as Guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. designer Hannah Osborne here. I'd love you to join me on this Sunday mid-show for the return of the most amazing Murano glass beads. I've got some of my favourite colours coming back and I've got four kits with matching seed beads to go with all of them. So join me on Sunday the 22nd for the mid-show as part of the Vintage Weekend. Jewelry Maker phone is free from a UK landline, so call us today to place your order.